Oh my god, Niffler's are such a mood. My spirit animal. Nifflers are my spirit animal. It, it is what it is. They're cute, they're chunky, they like to eat, and they're looting like crazy. That's... That's me. <laughs> Hide any shiny things. Okay. We are back in Hogwarts, my friends. Sadly, no TikTok in our country. Um... Uh, parts of it, that's why I have it on, on the YouTube Shorts video, because I know some countries have TikTok banned, and for those people, I made the um, the YouTube Shorts um, channel, so I upload all my YouTube videos on the YouTube Shorts, uh, so you guys can, um, can watch it as well. Okay, so we left off, we unlocked Neve uh, Fitzgerald's portrait, so there's one more. And then pretty much the end, right? I have some news about them as well. Can you meet me soon? I fear that some of what I uncovered has to do with you. Uh-oh. It's to Dade. When you have a moment, please stop by the room of requirement. Deke mentioned you might be interested in learning how to breed beasts. <gasps> Bags! Vex, my friend, how was your birthday? Hello. Know to keep shiny objects away from Liz unless you want to lose it. Yes. Oh, you're. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombarda. Once you have completed the tasks I've set forth, speak to me after class. Yes, yes. Bex, my friend, thank you for 35 months on tier 2. Oh, you you absolute legend. How was your birthday? Thank you so much for the support, my friend. I hope you're doing good. Hi, Daft Cat. Hello. You watched all the Fantastic Beasts movie. I've seen one of them. Ashgoth gift is a sub to OX. OX, welcome to the Chonkies. Thank you very much. Hi, Pedro, welcome. How many dark spells you've unlocked so far? Uh, just Crucio. Oh, stop it, guys. I almost feel like a celebrity in here. Thank you for all the lovely congrats. I hope you had a beautiful birthday, my friend. When you have a moment. I would like to pick it up. Oh, my slots are full. Gotcha. This music is so cheeky, right? What's your favorite Harry Potter movie and why is it Prisoner of Azkaban? Actually, it's not Prisoner of Azkaban. My favorite Harry Potter movie and book is The Half-Blood Prince. Yep. Finally, a favorite question that I could answer. Yes! <laughs> Finally. Hello, Deke. You wanted to talk to me. Indeed. Uh, Deke thought you might want to learn how to build a breeding pen so that you can breed beasts. I had, I had, I will repeat, I had tons of cake and coffee. And... <laughs> Uyur? Was there some Uyur? Hi Nim, hello! You're a hairy wizard. <laughs> Couple of fire for me? Mm-hmm. It has to be Chamber of Secrets. <laughs> um... The Almighty Salmon. A first time sub. This early in the day. Sheesh. Guys, welcome a first time subscriber, please, with lots of chunky chunks in chat. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. And the ad free watching. Thank you very much for the support. Thanks for the follows as well, guys. Okay, um. That sounds like a very good idea. Rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. Uh, young beasts are particularly vulnerable to poachers. 
Breeding beasts here in the room will allow us to keep the younger ones safe. I see. What do I need to do? First, bring a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Deeg suggests rescuing Thestrals, as they're at great risk from poachers. Noble creatures, but their relationship with death gives them a bad reputation. They're prized by poachers for their tail hairs. Where's this a I've seen Thestrals before, but where would I find a pair of them nearby? Deke has seen some wild Thestrals not too far from the Hogwarts grounds. Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the pen from Tomes and Scrolls and gather the materials it requires. Once you've rescued the Thestrals and you have the spellcraft, you come and find Deke. I think the logic um, is a bit slack in here. So... The young ones are easily caught and in danger from poachers. And that's why we breed them, we make them. <laughs> huh? If we don't breed them, then there is no no babies because they don't they don't start anything in here. Logic. <laughs> Salmon, thank you so much. Welcome in. Hi just Mibble, welcome. Had a couple of shots of spiritual water. I'm not gonna deny. <laughs> I know you. <laughs> Can you crossbreed beasts? Nah. The last of us spores. Dick has been using the hot tub again while this was out questing and all the steam. Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, rescue male. Oh no, the male Thestral quest. Oh god, that was so difficult. But this time I have glaciers, right? So we're gonna. This is gonna be maybe a piece of cake this time. So you poached them yourself, right? Did you finish your Ravenclaw playthrough? High Overgrown, yes, I finished it. Uh, it's not 100% done, but it is done. Okay, Thestrals, here I come. You're my lucker. Okay, wait, we need this and we need this. Do they see me already? I'm invisible. What do you mean? What are you? Um. Please. God damn it. Ha ha! There, there. There, there. I'm going to hurt you. No, I just froze you. <laughs> That's it. Um, and now we need to go to Hogsmeade and get the tome. Here, okay. This, did you notice the TikTok that showed an example of how this game has such details from the books, especially the prefect's bathroom? After you send it me, to me in DMs? Yes, I've seen it. <laughs> Hi, Sid. Hello, I'm good. How are you doing? Hi, sweet. Hello. Hi, Sometimes Neuromancer. It seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Is it Xmas already? Yeah, look. Also, I'm having my, my Xmas Magic Christmas Harry Potter who, um, sweater on. Hey, wait, I don't have a wand in, my, a wand in my hand. What's going on there? Wasn't there a spell that allows you to slow them down or something? Yeah, but it's not as f it's not lasting as long as uh, Glacius. So Glacius is the best one, I feel. There's um, Arresto Momentum. Ah, it's always nice to see but you. Glacius makes them, like, fall, and then they are frozen for a while, and then after that they're, like, tumbling. So it's basically like a stun lock, you know, for a bit. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Hi, Venomancer, welcome. Have you tested Kingdom Come Deliverance, or is it, is it one the, on the playing list? Hi, Sorcerer, it's actually on the to-do list. Breeding pen. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. 
Now I can conjure a breeding pen in the room. Best get back to Deke with the Thestrals. Chopping station, dunk composter, spellcraft, hopping pot, spellcraft. Unlocks the village, conjure a hopping pot. This time, a type of magical little pot will periodic brew, random select potion. Ooh. Material refiner, spellcraft. Unlocks the ability, conjure a material finer, use it to produce moonstone essential. Potting table with two large pots. Not too shabby. Potting table with a medium pot spellcraft. Uh, potting table with two medium pot spellcraft. T-shaped potion station spellcraft. Ooh, mamma mia. Not bad. I like it when Liz wears stuff with green on- Oh no, is there green on him? Oh no, it's cutting out, right? Oh, I'm so stupid. I forgot about it again. You can't- as a streamer, you can't- green screen. You can't wear green, man. <laughs> I wonder if my- my socks are being cut out as well. I wear Slytherin socks. Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is the most evil thing you've done so far? I'm using the curses. You can't be that evil in this. Um, hi, my lord. Yeah, welcome. I made good experience with Vingardium Liviosa, but haven't compared it to Glacius. Hmm. I levitate them with catching bees? Yeah, but with the, like, Thestral, for example, it's very hard to catch them, I think. I, I, I tried and I failed lots of times. Hi, Dusty. Hi, Hades. Hello, Xander. Hello. It's only small yeast, don't fret. Okay. <sighs> Should I buy anything else? Nah, it's this. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Stop. Stop. Let me know if there's anything else I Spellbook. Meet me in the Undercroft. I, I found knew something. it. Ooh. Meh. 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 Oh, 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 perfect perfection. Extraordinary 69. That's perfection. Ooh, that's also better. That's also better. This can go. This can go. This can go too. And this. This can stay. Wait. Yeah, no, this can go as well. This can go. This can go, and what about you? This can go as well. Okay, so we have a coat, a uniform, and a hat. Okay. Let me know if Hi, Game Boy. Else I can do Hi, Tiny. Her. It's just magic, exactly. La, da, 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 da. Okay, a hat. We got a new. What? Oopsie, put in the wrong button. <laughs> oh man. And then this. 69. Oh no, this was not the 69, the 69 was here. Oh my god, I'm always clicking the wrong buttons. Ugh. Nah. Nope, nope, I want my cool leather jacket back. Yep, yep. This one. Very good, very nice. Love how Liz gets Italian gesture when talking about 69. <laughs> the Italian hands. <laughs> oh man, I wish I could like remove these for good. I could. Hmm. Thank you for the follows, guys. Welcome to the lizards. Nice to have you in the shadow of discovery. Speak with Sebastian in the Undercroft. Nice. I'm just gonna quickly go to the no wait first first I sell the three parts that I have I need to I need to work on my inventory management let's look at what we have shall we Joso thank you for gifting us up to nomini san nomini san enjoy the emotes welcome to the chunkies hi Potter let me know morning. if there's anything else I can do to help hi bipolar please don't call me babe thank you and welcome in Um uh, so wait, um map Hogwarts And then we go back to Deke who's so proud of all the potions that I've brewed. Hi Tamarin, welcome. Have you learned Crucia already? Yes I have. Hi Tamarin. How are you doing? Turn to Deke. Hi, Deke. Mm. 
Why why is the camera doing this? Is this normal? Is this supposed to happen? Because he's so small? I'd like to ask you about changing the room ambience. There. Yes. I've rescued the Thestrals and bought the spellcraft for the pen. Excellent. Now, to breed your Thestrals, simply release them into the same vivarium in which you conjure the pen. Then use the pen to start the process. Come and see Deke when you're finished. I shall. I wonder where I should conjure their pen. This is definitely for the Thestrals. Hi, Rifle. Ashgore, thank you. Deke never grows tired of the room surprises. We now have the perfect place for those Thestrals. Please let Deke know once you've bred them. Yes, yes. Ashgoth, my friend, thank you so much for the gift to sub to Tiny Titan. Tiny Titan, enjoy the emotes. Revelio. Beautiful. The music's so nice. It's very uh, Moonshine Sonata, right? Not anymore. <laughs> I think Deke has a bit of a, a gas issue. Come on! Why could you not climb up there? Revelio. Do you guys have a favorite when it comes to those vivariums? Like, which vibe do you prefer? Hi, Emgo. Welcome. How's it going? Hi, Koreki. Good to see you again. Is that the new Lord of the Rings game everyone talks about? Hello. Um, I know there's more loot somewhere. Oh yeah, I was up here, right on these on these stones. Hello from the Arctic. Ooh, wow. Hello. Greetings from Switzerland. I like the meadowy meta type one. Is that the very first one that you get? Revelio. I'm just looking for the loot boxes. Incendio. I will embrace the chunky. <laughs> Oops. I wanted to light this up. Lumos. There you go. There's a chest. There's moonlight. Oh, moonlight. Okay. Um, in in German, it's Mondschein, which is moon. Mo I just, <laughs> I'm sleepy. Okay, so it's moonlight sonata, I guess. I never. I just loosely translated it now because I don't know how it's called in English. Mondschein sonata. Man, I love waiting in mud. Nice. And this is perfect for you. Revelio. So, how did I get up there? I forgot. None of them are pretty prison. It's like a prison. True. That's that's the issue that I have with the vivariums. You can make them as pretty as you want. It's still, still a prison for the beasts. <laughs> They're not free. I prefer freedom. I think up there was another chest, Rebellion. right? Maybe not. Moonlight Sonata, okay, thanks. <laughs> what house are you in? Um, with this character or like me, what I was sorted into naturally? Can you use broom? No. You can also see that um, there's the this icon next to the minimap with the, the red circle with the cross through. That means that you cannot use any mount or broom. Okay, so let's go. Mm. 
so... Okay, use the breeding pen to breed the Thestrals. Okay. But first... Okay, they get food. They're all busy. <laughs> Hi, Ben. Hello. It's not to release beasts back in the wild. Uh, I don't know. So the Vivarums are only temporary, so it's not as much as prison as Schutzgewasa. Yeah. I'm, I'm not a fan of it, though. You know what I mean? Will provide the energy for the work out ahead. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, fast rolls. It's snoo snoo time. I used it though, so use the breeding pen to breed the fast rolls. Job done. This place is cool. Okie dokie, so am I just going back to Deke now and tell them that I'm done with this? Or am I supposed to tell them when they're when they're done with the breeding? Don't kill the vibe the Viper's family. I guess I have to wait until Um until a baby has been born. Um, how would you rate the game out of 10? Need something to pass the time up here in the cold. Uh, what games do you like? I would give the game... There's still stuff that could be better, so... Maybe... 8? So it's not it's not perfect, but it's it's great fun. I like it. Hi, Fuller, welcome. If you ride a, f a fast roll and get hit on your head and forget your witness death, can you still see it under you? I guess so, yeah. Uh, let's check what other quests we could do. Did daily and keys and the shadow of discovery. Yes. We want to do everything that we could with Sebastian so I learn all the curses. As quickly as possible. Where am I to fight him? In the Undercroft. Oh, I forgot. Oops, Hogwarts. Okay, hang on. <laughs> uh, here. Job not till- uh, Job not done till baby. Okay. I got it, I got it. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome. Aunt Liz. You need- Needs Quidditch. I, I think it, Quidditch is not the issue that I have with the game. What I would like to see is actual consequences for uh, decisions. Having having really decisions that you could really roleplay, so you could actually be really a bad guy, right? Um, and uh, having different endings, like majorly different endings. I just I just like when I'm role playing and I'm playing a game like this. I would really like to have different outcomes and um, I can't believe we found ourselves trapped. In really, an option, you know. And then sometimes it's still buggy. So there are a few things that I would change, but overall, it's still a great experience, I would say. What's the score for Witcher Three then? Almost a 10? <laughs> that's, that's my favorite game. It's also not perfect. There are a few things, but um, they're minor, and I still love the game every time I play it. I mean, I have almost 800 hours in The Witcher and three playthroughs, so I think that speaks volumes. You'll never believe what I've learned. Tell me all about it, Sebastian. 
What did you discover in the spellbook we found in the scriptorium? Salazar Slytherin's spellbook was a little difficult to interpret, but fascinating. Evidently, he encouraged teaching dark magic at Hogwarts. Neither the Imperious Curse nor the Killing Curse was unforgivable during his time. He believed students should be prepared to use dark magic when necessary, not to fear it. That's why we had to use Crucio to gain access to the Scriptorium. He didn't want his knowledge shared with anyone who was afraid of the power of dark magic. I agree. We did what we had to do. It was hard to do, but casting Crucio was our only option. And I'm glad we did it, because in the spellbook I also found something else. References to a lost relic, which, from what I can tell, grants the holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. And you think this relic might be able to save Anne? Precisely. I plan to search for this relic, but I don't think we should tell anyone. Especially Ominous. He wouldn't understand. There are two endings. Hmm. There are several dialogues that desperately need more variation, the shopkeepers, yeah. And what your character says. I wonder how it's like to live in such a small hamlet, blah blah blah, you know. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. I always say travel broadens the mind. You know, you hear them so often because they're so repetitive. <laughs> I wish they would mix it up a little. Add more, add more variation to the, to the, to the voice lines as well. Is this your second playthrough? Hi, uh, Taya, welcome in. Yes, it is. It's also in the title. Hi all, welcome in. Serious fan, yes, yes. Um, did you ever try online RP uh, like GDA, Red Dead or some other games? I tried online Red Dead. I'm not a fan of online multiplayer stuff. Like, multiplier, and I don't like that much. Sometimes with friends, rarely. Um, and online, never. <laughs> never. Uh, I plan to search for his relic, but I don't think we should tell him, especially him, as he wouldn't understand. Okay, we with this playthrough we go full Sebastian fanboy, so I won't say a word. I see no reason to involve Ominous. I'm glad you agree. When I know more... I shall send an owl. And don't feel sorry for Ominous. Keeping this to ourselves for now is for his own good. I'll decide what's for my own good. Ominous, we were just about to get some air. Care to join? You're a liar, Sebastian. I heard everything. You swore you'd never engage in anything to do with dark magic again. No, I didn't. I said I understood you wanting that. I'd never swear to give up on finding a cure for Anne. You don't know when to stop, do you? I know when not to stop. Leave this alone, Ominous. Yeah, I'll be I'm, on my way. I, uh, I have business to attend I to. I'm not letting this go. I oh god damn! I have to talk to him. He's gonna be mad at me. <laughs> I, 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 I told Sebastian that we should talk to Ominous and, and Sebastian objected and then o Ominous came out and now I was agreeing with Sebastian so let's see what he says now. Ominous, Sebastian meant well. I know what I heard. You knew I wouldn't agree with this. Going after that relic is not a good idea. Sebastian doesn't even realize it, but he's as irresponsible and reckless now as his parents were years ago. It's why they died. I knew his parents died, but I never heard what happened. Mr. and Mrs. Sallow were professors, spent nearly every waking moment in the cellar library, noses buried in books. Anne and Sebastian were upstairs when it happened. They heard a sudden crash and ran downstairs, but it was too late. Their parents had crumpled to the floor. A defect with the lamp in the cellar caused the room to fill with an undetectable toxin. Sebastian and Anne were helpless, they had no magic yet. What a horrible story. It is. That's why I can't understand Sebastian's recklessness. I've practically lost Anne. I cannot lose Sebastian too. Please avoid anything to do with that spell book. Nope. Those references in the book seem promising. 
Everything to do with Salazar Slytherin seems promising until it's too late. I hope Sebastian pursues this no further, but if you think he might, please let me know. Mm. It would mean a lot. Mm, no. No. Uh, hi, Zedekiah. Thank you very much for the 100 biddies. How are you doing? <clears throat> What's your play a Witcher story focused MMO? Uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not a fan of MMO. I tried Elder Scrolls Online, but only because you don't have to play it m with others. You can you can literally play solo. Um, what else am I gonna do now? Wes, hi! Thank you for the 13 month resub. How are you doing? Travel bronze your minds, y'all. <laughs> hi, Deeks, welcome. <clears throat> I want to decide with his uncle against Sebastian. Yeah, me too. Maybe hiding... My, maybe trying to hide secrets from a guy who's literally called Ominous isn't the best idea. Uh, first I was supportive of him now in second playthrough. I tried to stop him at every chance. Does this even make any difference? Not really, right? This is what I mean. Like, you can, you can try to stop people but you have no impact on them. Absolutely, they just they just do. The outcome is the same. Hi, Weeby, welcome in. Just saying nope so easily, but down in her so she's like, I don't want to be bad. Yeah, I don't really want to be bad, but it's it's what I said. I'm gonna do bombarda. I want to learn bombarda. Where do I gotta go for this? Acquire a deer crawl with a knapsack. Acquire a giant purple toad with a knapsack. <laughs> Why? Why the toads? Why the toads? I hate toads. But I don't like this. Puff skin. I don't wanna. Oh, who's this? Infamous foe. I've been here already, right? I could just go and and kapow. This is a lone wolf. I really, I really like single players. So the focus on this channel will always be single player games. I played ESO solo for five years. How did you deal with the dungeons? I think that was quite difficult. I hope you're having fun. Hi, Pilfy? Pliffy. X Pliffy. Hi, welcome. Yes, I do have fun. Welcome in. That curiosity young people tend to nurture. It's been ages since I've found anything worth a poking Why can I not land here? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Keep one Puskin out of four Roberts. Hmm. Revelio. Ooh. I like me some gold. Where's everybody? Aha. Uh -huh. Over there. Look like you've been had by the flopper women too. <laughs> I love how the dog goes like <laughs> with the dogs it looks even more funny. Okay? Is she smacking herself? I think she has some issues. Don't chicken out, show toads. Oh man, I really don't like toads. Nah, you wanna leave it at least a week before you go poking about the tracks of a streeler. Need to let his track. Is she on a phone call? Where's the infamous foe that I wanted to kill here? Are we done and done? That'd be funny. Did I? 
Don't tell me I just killed them with, like, just destroying the the platform they were standing on. I oh. prefer the latter. Poach a tracker. Um, what other platforms do you play on or do you strictly play on PC? I have a PlayStation 4 and a PlayStation 5. That, that's it. PC, PlayStation 5, pretty much. Not worth the trouble, if you ask me. Oh. But what happened to the... Hmm. Hi, Purple. Welcome. Hi, Mango. Solving the four main dungeons was a lot of fun. Very challenging. I could only do the easier ones. Mm hmm. Oh, I can't rescue it. Damn it. My Alohomora is too, too low. Was the first one really nice? Must have been the wind. <laughs> Did I just kill the infamous foe with, with Petrificus Totalus, yeah? Easy, e easy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And that isn't on hard mode. <laughs> Sheesh. Okay, there's a page here somewhere, right? Revelio. This poor egg. Oh, I got an achievement. Nice. Confringo. Boss was the first one? Wow. I was looking for a big health bar and I didn't see any, so I was like, okay. Maybe there's just none. Hi, cats. Hello. Okay. Anything else we could do here? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Classical tea moment. <laughs> tea. <laughs> Wee. Ooh. It's another big chest. We like big chests so we cannot lie. Hi, Venom. Welcome. Oh, what? No, 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 no. Okay, we want to do the cool way. This is the cool way. So I think I saw something else here. Aha. Uh -huh. I wonder. I wonder, how do I get to that chest? Not the one that I meant, but okay. They need a hardcore mode for this game. I, I wish there was a new game plus, where you can keep the visuals, like the <clears throat> the cosmetics for your for your outfits. That'd be nice. <clears throat> These auto-generated Twitch subtitles are terrible. I'm sorry. It's probably me because I, I should speak more um, clearly. Then it's better. Okay, I need to find a deer crawl and I need to find a giant toad. Uh, I remember that there were some giant purple toads in the Forbidden Forest somewhere here. Puffskin, Niffler, Niffler! Mooncalf, Unicorn, Jobbernal, ugh. I guess I'm gonna just fly in here and like revel you like crazy. Hi, Knopfas, welcome. Hi, Dio, welcome. I didn't like that uh, top bad guys, number two and number three, resisted my Avada Kid overfields. <laughs> Found them more hilarious. I think the issue is, Pega, when you really have to rely on those, Rebellion. right? When you can't, when you can't hear and this is all you have. And then my subtitles go. Oh, this music! This is absolutely my favorite track. Peter. 
it upon your heads when. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Sorry, hippogriffs. Mongrels. Ah, screw this. Right? And then they're like And then like this is your first time, right? This just makes it more embarrassing for you, my friend. I like the way he says Crucio. Hi, Professor Woland. Giant purple. There we have something. Yeah, okay, the fire that I'm at right now is the closest already. Do you recall so much of the south? Okay. Hopefully I can fly over this. Probably not, huh? Looks like uh, you're gonna be blocked by this invisible wall kind of thing. No? Oh, okay. Cool. Stripped of all that it is, is noble. Weakness, Lord, no, I have no waypoint because I was literally just doing the main quest so far, if I could. I just do the things to get all the spells and did the things that I need to continue with things. Like, I tried to unlock Alohomora, so I did a few demiguys things, but I don't have all, I just have a few. <clears throat> this is my second playthrough. My first was very, very thorough, but my second, not so much. What is that, Pega? Because the, the toads I have now. Apparently. Thank you. Places. Hey, what do you mean? I said... 
I don't understand why he said there's no beast in target. Ugh, toads. Professor Howell will never believe this. Okay, and the next one is... Oh, this is Hogwarts, so... Somewhere here. Here. It looks like. Somewhere here, huh? Thank you, um, thank you, Pega. Yeah, Cusco, thank you, I found it already. Do all the brooms turn red? What do you mean, turn red? Hi, Core Maker, welcome. Thank you very much, Constable. I'm sorry that you have to deal with this again. <laughs> I could also try to do myself, but my program tends to crash with longer videos. Revelio. So roughly in this area, right? I'm just revaluing and hope that it will unlock something for me. Mm. It doesn't seem like there's a new unlocked area, huh? Ah, here, up here, exactly. Okay. Nice. Let's go. Josu, thank you very much for the gift. It's up to Captain. <laughs> Captain, enjoy the emotes in the app you're watching. I should investigate. Hi, Patrick. Welcome in. Hi, Dravial. Please. Okay. Assignment's all finished. Okay, now we can go back. <clears throat> Got him! <laughs> yes. Hogwarts. So I need to go to the... Wait, no? Am I not so... Ah, oh, yeah, okay. I am. It always confused me with the, gold with the golden line. <laughs> a dodo burp, yes! The polka bag works quite well. Yes, it does. Mm. Hi, Jen. Hello, how are you? <sighs> Hi, core maker. Welcome. I'm a bit sad. No, it bothers me when, when the when the stream crashes or something like this happens. Yeah, and the only thing it can do is updating drivers. Which is already done. I literally checked a few days ago. Hey, hey I, I, I progressed time, did I not? How often do I have to do this? Maybe it didn't register? I don't know. <laughs> All the classmates are in class and I'm just chilling on the ground. <laughs> emotional damage! Yeah, really, it's, it really is emotional damage. Hi, twin. Thank you very much for the 969. Where's the marker? Oh. Thank you, Ashka. Thank you very much. <gasps> it's a baby Niffler! Wow. That's cool. Excellent work today. Class dismissed. Thank you, Ashka, Hopefully for the gift I'm itself. Fond Thank of you very much. In this class. My brother's doing well, thanks to you. Beginner's luck, I say. You'll not- I'm Melda. I completed Shut it. your assignment, Professor. I'm ready to learn Bombarda now. Good. Now, this spell comes with a caveat. It should only be used when necessary. A the caveat? exploding charm, as you might suspect, can hurt people. Use caution when casting uh -huh. it. Uh-huh, I will use caution. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Of course. Of course, Professor. I will, Professor. I will hold you to that promise. Now, you must be precise in your wand movements. We don't want you blowing your hand off. Go ahead. 
Nice and steady wand movements. Remember, the exploding charm is highly volatile. Bombarda. <laughs> sure, I probably. Well done. Now, let us put it into practice, shall mm -hmm. we? Yes, we shall. Go ahead. Is this bomb? No, this is Bombarda. Um. On the pumpkins. Excellent wand work. Cast the spell just like that every time. Assured and in control. Thank you, Twin, for the 569 videos. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I see broke uh, AC broke as well. No mini sun. Oof. I'm sorry to hear. Textbook execution. Bravo. Bravo. Okay, what else could we do? Fire and vice. Meat poppy sweeting. Is this still not done? Hmm. Okay, then let's meet poppy sweeting. Where do I meet her, though? Oh man, before we go, I have to remove this. This is bothering me to see the, the purple mark the entire time. So... Poppy is here, okay. Turn Poppy to the dark side? I feel this is not possible. I have the feeling this is uh, not an option. <laughs> I think uh, it comes with a name. I think she's too sweet to actually join the dark side. No matter how many cookies they have. Yeah. I gotcha. Hi, Poppy. I'm gonna walk past Tell you because I need right. to go here. Natty told me what the two of you did. Ooh, we're waiting for a romantic evening meetup. Something is wrong with your skirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 ooh. Sheesh. High wing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe, Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want High Wing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead, and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Mm -hmm. Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack? It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Hauntel Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. Why? What is it? The poacher's best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making, at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poacher spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Hey, pet thesis, welcome. Hey, Panthamore, does it rain sometimes? I think it does, maybe. But now it's snow time, so when, if anything, it would snow. Hi, Urban, welcome, good morning. Hi, Van Helsing. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after High Wing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. Mm. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? <laughs> I wonder. Okay, Poppy, let's go. I wonder how... How much of her quest line is main quest and when it becomes side quest? <gasps> A centaur! Tread carefully. Oi, mate! 
Nice An bow. entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we There's don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. Uh-oh. He was certainly a charmer. <laughs> that could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind, and the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. <gasps> that's the third time I've seen a dugbog behave that violently. It seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. Hmm. I've noticed that too. It's almost like there's something in the water. Hmm, maybe there is. Hi, little crafty, welcome. This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. Search for sign of poachers. How about this? Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Thank you, DM. I've never fallen from quite this high, falling into your ocean eyes. Hi, Actimus. Welcome. How are you? Hi, Snowdrop. Hey, Miss Cariello. Hello. Revelio. Pelt. Poor beasts. Still smoking. They can't have been gone long. This is goblin metal. Oh. <laughs> Seems out of place in a poacher camp. I should tell Poppy about it. Poppy! Hi, Arno. Welcome in. Anything interesting? Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. I don't have a good feeling about this. I'm okay, Actimus. I'm a bit sad. My PC keeps crashing. This bothers me a bit. How do goblin and poacher interests align? Oh, this is so nice. Look, down there. Definitely poachers. No creatures, though. So, what are they doing out here? Let's take. Um. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment, or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. Is there a buff or debuff when you drink? Mm, not to my knowledge, no. a keen eye. Take me, for instance. My eyes as keen as a nifflers on a pile of gold, or a nogtail to a sow. No, I'm not bragging. That's just... Who the hell? Merlin, 
<laughs> Your journey has ended. Oh, well. Yeah, <laughs> about that. <laughs> Why did the, the entire bridge just break? Just because... <laughs> Today's not my day, man. Oh, hi, Liza. Welcome, how are you? What? Oh, man. Click the wrong buttons. Oh, man. Okay, the good thing is that I don't have to have the conversation with Poppy again about uh, what approach we want to try. You can feed the beast, or it can feed you. I prefer the latter. Seems we may have an intruder in our midst. the minister for magic himself what is going on here only one way to find out by looting everything and then going into the tent of course wow dragon skull okay hi seedle welcome sir seedle sir seedle i don't know how to pronounce it hi sense now and secrecy no wonder the poachers were in hogsmeade so much likely taking bets and spreading the word given how crowded it is here how could they possibly enjoy this the centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard kind there must be more dragons here the poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons we should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around but be discreet you especially can't afford to be spotted Okay. That's a brilliant idea. Then I'm so smart. It was sinking strong in a bucket. I'm gonna take them out though. He he he. Revelio. Next playthrough only Petrificus to Talos. You, you, you learn it relatively late, so you cannot thinking. start with it. Would they join us? Ah, they say we go too far. The violence isn't going to get us what we want. Hello, how nice of you to stop by. <laughs> okay, there goes the Petrificus to Talos thing. Screw these, I'm gonna fight them. Hi Beef, hello, hi Zelda. I might greet people twice now. Because my of course my PC restarted, so my, my plugin is restarted as well. Did you hear those goblins? Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Hi, Poppy, Henry. Something's going on behind you. What's going on down there? Hi, Shiny. Hi, Mookie. They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite a fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Let's even her odds, shall we? Let's. What I wouldn't give to be a devil, guys, right now. <laughs> Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hebridean from the looks of it. We can't leave it here, not with the plans they likely have for it. Okay, okay. I'm also not leaving the loot because uh, God knows what they're gonna do with it. So... 
Why do I have to s Hello, Amora. sneak so badly? Hi, Hannah Diaz. Welcome, Hardy. Hello. How are you guys? Happy Sunday. All right. I have the egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Uh -huh. Let's make them count. Okay. Yes. A more hushed Yes, yes. Very wise. Careful! Okay. <laughs> moment for a quick time event to hit Protego. Incendio. 
I wish the range for Incendio was really this big. This way. Okay, Drax, enjoy your lunch. My fingers always ache after fighting this game. How come? Hey, honest. That was a Hebridean black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. I don't think she knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. Be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle. Okay. Quest complete, fire and vice. Quest updated, full of the dead. Oh, isn't that a nice view here? Look at this. Boy. Nice. Love the sound of this game, the ba the bass vibes, yeah. Bass. Uh, yeah. My nose is itchy. Um, Hogwarts map and then room of requirement. Hi, Lindsay. Good morning from Switzerland. Well, for me, it's noon, but yeah. <laughs> it's time you learned the transformation spell. After you've completed the required tasks, which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide, attend my class to learn the new spell. Afterwards, we will discuss your progress thus far in the term. Okay. Let's wait, where's here it is. Ooh, Daedalus scarf, stinger dueling gloves, patchwork sorcerer head. So scarf, gloves, and hat. Okay, gotcha. <whistles> Mamma mia. Okay, but I want the bare hands. And then... Was it also the hat? I think, huh? <laughs> These hats, man! <laughs> and a scar was another new thing, I think. Yes. Anything new and better? No. Okay, cool. Nice. Um, hi Roma, welcome in. Oh, Tenerife, hello, I've been there once. Uh, but it was just a little stop before we were going to um, Gomera, La Gomera. Very beautiful island. You, I didn't know you could hide the cloves. Yeah, you can, um, it's a bit, it's a bit, um, not hidden, but like they made it a bit unintuitive, in my opinion. You you just select what you actually want for the effects, and then you go in this view, hover over, and then you it says change appearance with X, and then you click on X, and then you change the appearance of it. I think they could have done it a bit better. It's a uh, doesn't feel very natural to do this. So um, I have that dealing damage to a cursed target inflicts damage to all cursed targets. I have strike an enemy curse by crucial releases projectile the curse is a nearby enemy. And then defeating a cursed enemy restores some of your health is nice. A cursed effect remains an enemy for a longer period of time, which is good. Rest of momentum, no wait. Um Spyamus has the same effect, Rependo has the same effect. Stupefy has the same effect. Which one did I want? Killing enemy for Vodakata kills all This one is the end goal, but this is level 22. Why can't I not have it? Because must be able to cast a Vodakadaver, okay. Okay. So, defeating enemies restores some of your health. Then I want definitely I want this 
cursed longer and then this so i'm gonna i'm gonna curse him with crucio then i'm gonna hit one of the targets to infect everybody with curse and then i can kill one with avada kedavra and then everybody dies this is gonna be so overpowered that combo is so op <laughs> Uh, and I haven't even played with it yet, but I just I just know it's gonna be so <clears throat> so good. Hi easy peasy, welcome. Uh hi nameless, welcome. Happy Sunday to you as well. Hi random. Hogwarts Christmas sweater, nice, yeah, thanks. I just hardly ever get to wear it, right? Cause just one month. One month a year. So quests. Oh yeah, I need to talk to Deke, right? About the folds? The... The baby Thastral. Much to remove all spell cooldown. Really? There is such a thing? Could you remind me what I'm to do with the Thastral streak? Oh, okay. I'm supposed to do something with the Thastrals. So let me go back in... Um... Was it here? Yeah, this one, right? Whee! My Hufflepuff thought I only use the curses and poachers. <gasps> Baby, that's true. Hello. Uh, here, you get some food. Oh, it's so small. There. I should let Deke know about the newborn Thestral. <laughs> Thestrals are cool. How do you get more gear slots? You uh, do the Merlin quest, the Merlin trials. The more, the more you do, you have those challenges, right, in the challenge tab. And when you do these, you will unlock more and more gear slots. But it's still very limited, and it's never enough. <laughs> never enough. Never, never, never enough. Hello, Deke. You'll be pleased to know that a little Thestral was born. How wonderful to have more Thestrals in our world. Such misunderstood beasts. I'm sorry that we can both see Thestrals, Deke. Deke is privileged to see such majestic beasts. But sometimes wishes Deke couldn't. Deke is to blame. What do you mean, to blame? Years ago, Deke's master ordered Deke to help him capture a phoenix the rarest of all beasts, that Master had spotted high on a cliff. The phoenix was the most beautiful beast Deke had ever seen. Deke begged Master to leave her be. When Deke hesitated to climb up the cliff as ordered, Deke had to punish himself. As Deke punished himself, Master grew angrier and angrier, and in his frustration cast at the regal bird. Deke suspects the phoenix was protecting eggs when it swooped down in fear and fury. Before Deke could reach him, Master fell from the cliff. Deke stayed on that cliffside for days, punishing himself, before Tobbs found him. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome. I know you're practicing dark arts. <laughs> I am one Mick. Uh, it's my second playthrough. I wanted to try it out. So I, my first playthrough was a good Ravenclaw. And my second playthrough, I wanted to do a Dark Arts Slytherin with the curses, doing evil decisions and being nasty, saying th stuff like this. It sounds to me as if your master got what he deserved. Deke never wanted anyone to get hurt. Not the Phoenix, not Tobbs, and not even Master. Deke often wonders what became of that Phoenix. Deke feels fortunate to be at Hogwarts now, helping you rescue beasts. Perhaps Deke can make amends for what came before. Hey, Custom. Hey, Howell. Welcome. You can sing too? <laughs> Hi, Segment. Welcome. Hi, Cor. Good to see you. Hi, Savarno. Welcome in.
Dum, 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 dum. Hi, Deimos. Welcome in. So, okay, this quest is done and done. So, and then... Um, Professor Weasley's assignment. Collect the field guide page in the underground harbor. Collect the field guide page from the book on intermediate transfiguration in the library. Oh. Oh. Oh, dear. Okay. Library. Okay, let's try. Let's see if I can actually remember all the things from the library thing. Uh... Hi Gaga, welcome in. Only English, please. We cannot moderate any other languages. Can I ask what the coins are you know next to bits and subs? Make a guess. I bet you will get to the answer if you think about it. So this is probably to get to the... Oh, this one! Um... This is four, right? Do you have- do you have to do it in the right order? I forgot. So first is the triangle with the lines through the lines. <laughs> This one. This is correct. Oh, I have to light them first, right? That was the issue. Okay. Oh, you can't use your super dodge in here? Okay. Two is the circle. This, um... This is four. And then, um, okay, the triangle with a circle is the third one. Whoosh. What happened to the hair? It was so awesome. It sadly clipped through the... Wait, is this the entrance? No. here okay um it sadly clipped through the hood and i really didn't like it and other people were complaining about it as well so i got him short hair i like the long hair as well but maybe i could change it back now that i'm not wearing a hood huh i just need to Rebellion. keep wearing this outfit that i'm wearing right now hmm actually not a bad idea maybe we go back to garrel Rivia. garrel by the river <gasps> Tanimi, hello, how are you? Good to see you. How's it going? My mother would like to speak with me. I believe she has learned about some of what we've been up to. I'm hoping she may be easier on me if you are there. That sounds like a you problem. Can we meet to the three broomsticks? It may finally be safe since we rescued the dragon from Horntail Hall. Doing good things, and you all? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just a bit frustrated because my PC has some issues. And... So this is the underground harbor. The Grey Lady. <laughs> I'd say hello, but she doesn't seem particularly social. Yeah. Revelio. Hi Dexmo, welcome. Hi Anise, hello. Hey Flash, thank you very much for the 469. Thank you very much for the donation. Oh. Morning, Liz. How are you enjoying your second playthrough with variation? I like it, Lurkstuff. 
You gone? Thank you very much for the first time sub with Prime. Guys, welcome a first time subscriber. A first time chonky. With lots of chonky chonks in chat, please. Thank you so much. Enjoy the emotes. I made them myself. And uh, yeah, welcome to the chonkies and uh, enjoy the, the ad free watching as well. Hi, Dino Guy. Hello. Hmm. Collect the field guide page from the book on intermediate transfiguration in the library. Library annex um, seems to be the closest. Hi, Blood Iron. Hello. Hi, Methos. Didn't get any Christmas presents? <gasps> oh, no. Yeah, <laughs> you gone. Welcome in. What inspired the creation of Chonky? Chonky with an O. Um, so, I'm Liz, right? And Liz, I was looking for for a mascot because I don't have any pets. So I wanted a mascot for the channel so I can draw emotes that would fit to mix it up a little bit. And um, somebody posted a meme on my Discord channel that basically said, imagine you get a daughter and you call her Lizard. You give her the name Lizard, and then her nickname is Liz, and then people be like, Oh, is your real name Elizabeth? And then she has to say, no, it's Lizard. And... Places. I felt that was funny, and since I was looking for something, like a mascot, um, I felt, okay, Lizard's actually a good idea. We just spell it with two Zs, because I'm Liz with two Zs, right? And then... Um, I was drawing some variations of uh, different Lizards, and... For some reason, oh yeah, I remember. Uh, I, I found this this cute meme the with book Professor Weasley wants me to get us upstairs. Um, I found this cute Pikachu meme where Pikachu is doing this, ah. uh, this this expression, and I wanted to do an emote with that expression, so I made a chunky with this, and then people said, "Oh, it's so cute, and it's so chunky," and then I was like, "Hmm, are we gonna call the lizard?" And then somebody suggested Chonky, and I was like, yeah, that's that's good. Sounds good. So, ever since, Chonky's a thing. And that's the story of Chonky. That book Professor Weasley asked me to find should be around here somewhere. Looking for the book into me. Professor Weasley asked me to, uh, get something from that book. May I have it? Did she now? I'll give you this book if... You humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz. Quiz? Okay. Some people call bits of knowledge trivia. I would argue that no knowledge is I trivia. am Gerald of Trivia, Hence, so that fits. I have created a small quiz, just for fun, focusing mainly on the law of the wizarding world. None of the other students will try it, no matter how many times I ask. They all say they have enough with schoolwork. Oh, they don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. A quiz sounds like fun. Splendid! Just a few questions and then I'll hand over this book. Let's see. Let us begin. Before the invention of the Golden Snitch, which magical creature was used in a game of Quidditch? Golden Snidget. The Golden Snidget. Correct! The Snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard he named is 69. Barbara Sprague. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question. Which potion is commonly referred to as liquid luck? Felix Felicis. Felix Felicis. Well done. Thanks to Coders for the Since three month research with Prime and Jody Emerald. lucky. Felix Felicis is a banned substance in all organized competitions. The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? What? The tale of the three brothers? Uh, the Deathly Hallows. The Deathly Hallows. Hi, According to Beedle the Bard, the Deathly Hallows consists of the Elder Wand, the Resurrection Stone, and the Cloak of Invisibility. Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? The Quaffle. The Quaffle. That's right. When a chaser throws the Quaffle through one of three hoops in a Quidditch match, their team is awarded ten points. True or false? Polyjuice Potion allows the drinker to change species. Ashko, 37 subs. Holy smokes! Thank you, so thank you so much, thank you so much, Eshko, for the 37 gifted subs. I hope everybody who got a sub enjoys the emotes. Can we get some hype in chat? Holy moly, 
Oh, Ashkoth, you absolute legend. Thank you so much. Everybody enjoy the emails. Thank you for watching. Hi, Lars. Welcome. Sheesh. Uh, so wait, true or false? Polyjuice potion allows the drinker to change species. This is false. False. Correct. While Polyjuice potion can be used to change things such as age or race, it cannot be used to change species. Well, I suppose this has gone on long enough. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. Hi, if Python. you have time to test your knowledge again, I have plenty more questions I could ask you. And I won't be giving you any more easy questions either. The next ones will be more difficult. Hi, Python. Enjoy the emotes. I know you just said thank you for the gifted sub, uh, but it's not in English and that's why it's got deleted. So, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh I, let's try i think maybe i remember all the correct answers now let's see if i do i'd like to answer more questions what governmental body directly preceded the ministry of magic oh shit the wizard's council that's correct mm -hmm. The Wizards' Council disbanded in 1707 after the creation of the International Statute of Wizarding Secrecy, which required a more structured government to support its enforcement. Which dragon breed is the smallest? The Peruvian Viper Tooth. Brilliant! Though the Viper Tooth is the smallest again, breed, Ashcroft. averaging at around 15 feet in length, it is also the fastest breed and feared for its venomous fangs. Who founded the village of Hogsmeade? Hengist of Woodcroft. That's right! It is believed that Hengist used the Three Broomsticks Inn as his home. The hide behind was accidentally created by crossbreeding a ghoul with what other magical creature? Oblivious, thank you for the five gifted subs. Holy moly. Thank you so much for the five. Everybody enjoy the emotes. Oh gosh, you guys are too kind. The hid hide behind was accidentally created by crossbreeding a ghoul with what other magical creature? I think I said the demi guys, but I think it was actually a rune spore. Was it a demi, guys? Shit. <laughs> but, oh man, I think I was torn between it. But demi guys would make sense because they can hide, right? And the hide behind sounds. A demi guys. Yes. No, While I was right. the hide behind has the power of invisibility, those who have seen it have described it as a tall, thin monkey with silver hair. What is the only <laughs> spell known to repel a lethefold? Thank you so much for the 40 gifted subs, Tanimi. What is the only spell known to repel a Lethifold? That I don't remember. I mean, this is like a defensive charm, right? So maybe... The Patronus charm. Well done. Okay. The only Tanimi, known thank you. of a Lethifold attack was a wizard named Flavius Belby, who was on holiday in Papua New Guinea at the time. Who published the law of elemental transfiguration? Gamp. Gamp. That's it. One of the principal exceptions to Gamp's law is that food cannot be conjured, though it can be summoned. What does the Hogwarts motto translate to? Never tickle a sleeping dragon. Never tickle a sleeping dragon. Correct. In Latin, the Hogwarts motto is Draco Dormians Nunquam Titillandus. Which magical creature is the only one known to produce eggs through its mouth? Uh, hi, Mike. No, it's not possible to just learn about a cadaver early and rush through the game. Thank you so much, everybody. <laughs> oh, God. Ashcroft for the 37 gifted subs. Olivia's for the 5. Tanimi for the 14. Peace out. Thank you for the first time sub with Prime. Welcome to the Chonkies. And Prime, thank you for the 5 gifted as well. Guys, you're so kind. Thank you so much. This was the rune spore, right? The rune spore. That's right. According to Parcel Mouths, each Thank of you the so rune much, spores with three heads serves a different function. The left head is the planner, the middle is the dreamer, and the right is the critic. 
Where is Ilvermorny School of Witchcraft and Wizardry located? I think it was Mount Greylock, but I'm not sure, but YOLO. Mount Greylock. Well done! Hmm. The American school was founded in the 17th century by Esalt Sayre and James Stewart. What is the most powerful love potion known to wizard kind? Amortensia? Amortensia. That's the answer. Amortensia smells differently to every person according oh, to what hi. they find attractive. Such as dusty book covers or... <clears throat> Are you interested in continuing on to the next round? They're my most difficult questions. Oh god, these were crazy. We try. Give me your worst. Wonderful. I do admire your thirst for knowledge. Emmerich the Evil was killed in a duel against whom? Egbert the Egregious. That's right. Emmerich gained notoriety for terrorizing villages in the south of England during the Middle Ages when he was the master of the Elder Wand. If a chaser keeps their hand on the quaffle as it goes through the goal, what foul are they committing? Turtle, thank you for the eight month resub. Happy eight months, almost a Twitch baby. Turtle, thank you so much. Welcome back to the Chonkies. Ashgoth, gifted a sub to Multi. Multi, enjoy the emotes as well. Hi, Phaedrus. Hello, welcome. <laughs> what are you guys rebelling? <laughs> um... Oh, God. The chaser keeps her hand on the quaffle as it goes through the goal. What foul are they committing? Oh god, was it stooging? <sighs> I remember there was something that I didn't want. Like, what, what I was like, ah, it's definitely not it. And I think then it was it. And I think bladging and stooging sounds the most reasonable. So maybe it's haversacking? Have a sucking. That's right. What? Blatching okay. <laughs> is flying to intentionally collide with a player. Stooging is when two chasers knock the other team's keeper away from the goals so that a third chaser can score. A bite from a mackled malaclaw has the unusual side effect of causing what? A bite from a mackled malaclaw has the usual side effect of causing what? Bad luck, I think it was. Bad luck. Native to the European coastline, the effects of a malaclaw's bite can last up to a week. What plant excretes stink sap? Oh, God. Hi, Toons. I'm good. How are you? Welcome. Hörst du Lauch, boy? Welcome in. Hi, Friday. Hello. Hi, Exo. Good to see you. Hello. I think I took this because it sounds like Sophorus. And I think that was wrong. And Fluxweed doesn't make sense at all. I think then we would have already done that. So I think it wasn't this. Mimbleus Mimbletonia. Correct. The nice. Mimbleus Mimbletonia plant secretes stink sap as a defensive mechanism when touched. Hi, Lost. Hi, Ram. The Pepper Up Potion Welcome evolved in. from a remedy created by which 12th century wizard? Was it Gamp again? <laughs> Bowman writes, Basil Flack, Linfred of Stinchcomb. The only name that says something to me is Bowman Wright. The Pepper Potion. Hi, Sora. Hi, Emirac. Welcome in. <laughs> when in doubt, go camp. <laughs> Do you guys know this one? I think I know I think I know that I took Bowman right in my first try. Pepper up potionable from a Renary Was the third one? Okay. Linford of Stinchcomb. Very good. Centuries later, Glover Hip So one so far that I would have Linford's picked wrong. Work to create the pepper up potion we know today. In the wizard and the hopping pot, what does the elder wizard leave for his son in the hopping pot? Single slipper. A single slipper. That's correct. The story was created by Beedle the Bard, but there are a few versions. I won't spoil what the slipper was for if you haven't read it recently. The Snallygaster is native to which region of the world? I 
think I took North America and was right. Snelly Gaster doesn't sound like something from the Amazon rainforest. Scottish Highlands. We are in the Scottish Highlands, and I don't remember ever encountering a Snelly Gaster, so I would say North America. North America. That's right. <sighs> The part bird, part reptile, is a distant relative of the Okami and has serrated fangs and a bulletproof hide. Damn, bulletproof Who hide. is the Muggle Knight featured in the Fountain of Fair Fortune? Emzet, right? Sir Emzet? Or was it Sir Luckless? It might have been Sir Luckless because- Yeah, I remember! I think it was Sir Luckless. I was like, ah, Sir Luckless would be too easy. Found- Fountain of Fair Fortune. Sir Luckless is too easy. And then I went with Sir Amzet because Lancelot is from something else. So I was like, yeah, it can't be Luckless. It needs to be Amzet. But I think then I was like, it is Luckless? Sir Luckless. Correct! The three witches in the story are named Asher, Althida, and Amata. Oh, I adore a story that ends with a twist. The world's largest kelpie is also known by what other name? Nessie. The Loch Ness Monster. Correct. The Office of Misinformation has worked diligently to discredit any muggle evidence of the kelpie's existence. Who was the first minister for magic? Was it camp again? <laughs> was it Gamp again, or are you just trolling me now? I think it was Gamp, right? Gamp, Gamp, Gamp? You lick Gamp. Hey, <laughs> you lick. Yes! <laughs> Gamp's greatest legacy was the founding of the Department of Magical Law Enforcement. It outlawed the unforgivable curses. You've answered all of my questions. Ah, oh, it's nice to know there's another student who appreciates the value of knowledge. I'm frankly astonished by how well you did. You have a talent for trivia. Thank you for humoring me by participating. I had a splendid time. Revelio. I put the book back on the pedestal for you. Revelio. Professor Weasley's tasks are complete. I should attend Transfiguration. Transfiguration. Lumos. I see you, little moth. How do wizards know about bullets? Well, just because they don't use it doesn't mean they don't know about it. Right? Oh wait, I got a page for it, I just forgot. <laughs> Give me that. Hi Dennis, welcome in. Hi Boltrag. Snelly Gaster from Fallout 76. <laughs> Can I? Oh, better not, huh? I don't want to break an ankle. So... No reward for answering all that? Mm. Well, you, you've got a reward. Like, lots of potions and stuff. Good for you. Wait. We shall wait. Looks like Johnny Depp's character in Fantastic Beast from the back. <laughs> I haven't watched that, sadly. I need to. I just watched the first um, Fantastic Beast somewhere to find it. Ten transfiguration claws during the day. Winky dink. <laughs> I heard. Raven Claw student. I heard Professor Weasley transfigured the book with all her test answers into an owl to stop students from cheating. Hmm, smart. Sleeping on the floor to wait, right? <laughs> hey, Gray, welcome. Ooh. Dennis, the, the story is before Harry Potter. 100 years before. Settle down, settle down. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing Transfiguration. Me say, is an exact science that can take a lifetime to master. But we needn't be daunted. Almost 
Anything can be transformed if you can just perceive the potential within it. As I see in all of you, tremendous witches and wizards, every one of you. Or it could just be my eyesight. Now, you all know what to do. Beautifully done. Nice. You okay, Sebastian? Sebastian was like, I want to tell you something. Uh, hello. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. And frankly, excelling in your schoolwork this year. The assignments have helped despite spending so much time on assignments. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. I'm not certain I needed all the extra assignments. And I'm certain you would not have been as successful without them. Mm. Now, it seems you've been making good use of the opportunities presented by your field guide. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. I've heard that you were able to grow a venomous tentacular. Growing such a magical plant is an accomplishment of which you can be quite proud. Thank you, Professor. I will say I'm especially impressed with all you've accomplished in light of the rumors of your extracurricular activities. <laughs> Were your meetings with Professor Black's house elf and exploration of various caves down by the lake connected in any way to Professor Fig? No. Not at all. I was, uh, Intrigued by stories of a giant squid and wanted to learn more, I encountered Scrope, who seemed delighted to share what he knew. I see. I admire your penchant for learning, but do remember that your classwork and field guide are designed to educate Close. you thoroughly. It'll be the end of the year in no time, and you'll want to be well prepared for your OWLs. I'll provide a final assessment at that time to ensure that you're ready for your exams. Okay, thanks. Until then, well done. You are dismissed. Mm, I was wondering why wizards would never use any kind of weapons and only stick with spells, but if creatures with bulletproof skin are nothing special, then it makes sense to only use spells, because they usually don't care how tough something's skin is. Hmm. Since our visit to Felmund, something dawned on me about the triptych. Meet me at the Overlook, just north of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll explain. Wrong button. My plan with the helmet failed, but I have another idea. I think we may be able to find what we need at a goblin mine south of Hogwarts. Meet me there and bring someone who speaks gobbledygook. Gobbledygook! That's gonna be funny again. A meet! <laughs> I want this game so bad. Why can't you get it? What part of Switzerland are you from? Uh, the German-speaking one. Or German-speaking one. <laughs> Expect Liz to snitch there. She's so nice, huh? Hi, Stabity. Welcome. Me could save my uncle's life. Hi, Rolenta. Welcome. Uncle Roland sends his best. He often asks after you and his owls. <laughs> Okay, so first we, since we now have a better, um, a better outfit, we can get our old hairstyle back. Uh, did you grow up reading the Harry Potter books or just started with the movies? I actually learned reading with the first book, but they have been out for a while when I, when I started reading with those. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? And then I watched the movies as well. 
Oh, come on. It's like always confuses me when he's getting stuck come in little on stones. In. Come on in. Don't be shy. Hi. What is it you might be interested in? I want my my long hair look back, thank you. You take care now, and I shall hope to see you soon. Baby Gerald of Rivia's back. How many languages are common to Switzerland? Uh, they have four native languages here. Hi, Winnie. Welcome in. Hi, Cage. <laughs> Carol reborn. <laughs> uh, okay, so what else could we do? Maybe, maybe I should sell some stuff. Where am I at right now? Um, sporting needs, lavenders, the Targaryen hair. Mm, it's not just Targaryen. But yeah, it's it's a very long version of Geralt's Witcher 3 hair, right? I like the one with shaved on the sides and then a ponytail with the top hair. That he, he has that in Witcher 2, I think, per default. I really like that. Or does he have something else? I don't remember right now. No, I think this is the default Witcher 2 hair, right? Hello there. Hmm. In the market for potions, are we? Would you kindly buy all the stuff that I have? Hey Staunch, hello, welcome in. Hi Enga. I wish you could just mark the things you want to sell and then sell it all at once. Oh boy, that was close. <laughs> I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. All my games are digital, how about you, Liz? Most of them, I sometimes get games uh, gifted and then they come in a hard copy. For example, I got the PlayStation 5 with hard copies of Horizon Forbidden West and The Last of Us Part 1. And I, I didn't choose, but if I, if I would get a game, I would always prefer to get the digital copy. For the language I've looked at learning, honestly, German seems the most daunting. Have you heard Finnish? <laughs> a dragon brief. After rescuing a dragon from the clutches of Project. Po oh, Poppy! Let's do the let's do the Poppy quest, right? Hi, Gold Milk, hello. Uh, I remember you struggled for gold in early game. Now the gold is chunky. And now that I don't need it anymore. <laughs> in the beginning, I really needed some gold. Thank you for the Let's follows, everybody. Welcome to the lizards. And also thanks for lurking. Oh, you should say over here when I was on the other side of the of the room. I'll say it again. I'm American and I live in Finland. Finnish is a disaster, but a great feeling of accomplishment after a few years. <laughs> I, I don't understand or know Finnish, but I've I've heard many people talking about how difficult it is to learn. This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I think a collar is precisely what we found at that poacher camp. I've never known poachers to use anything like that before. The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar, and Professor Fig was genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Exactly. Merlin. I don't think the dragon we set free was wearing a collar, but we should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. I... If 
I say this, am I gonna say no, I don't want to do this quest, or am I just being a bit of a dickhead? <laughs> Hi, Qatar, welcome in. Finland has been mentioned, I have been summoned. Hi, Bolo, welcome. We're just talking about how difficult Finnish must be to learn. So, do you guys know if I say, haven't we done enough for her? Am I just being a bit like, nah, I don't want to do this, I don't want to help things? Or is it literally, a, yeah, no, I think I'm done, I have enough. Do you guys know? Apparently nobody knows, okay, I'm just gonna try it. Must we? It seems a lot of trouble to go to for a creature we've already rescued. We should see this through. Let me find out where she is. There was something else that I wanted to discuss with you. I didn't want to press it before. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Why is he after you? If it's all right with you, I'd rather not say. At least not at the moment. Understood. We all have our secrets. I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. Let's go. I'll let you know when I have news of her location. Okay. Trying to be in character here. With my decisions and my answers. Mum's the word. It's all gobbledygook. <laughs> I think this was literally just a conversation, right? I think we could have that. That's not too bad. Uh, was that in Hogwarts? I think it was, right? Yeah, there you go. That's a, pe a pity you can side with the poachers. Oof. I mean, it would make it more evil, definitely. Would be more of a nasty playthrough character, but yeah, I think So frustrating. They don't like this. <laughs> they they didn't they don't didn't really want to give you all the options to be a really nasty character it feels. You wanted to speak with me, mother? I had hoped to speak with you alone, Natsai. Your message mentioned your concern about an unusual creature that was spotted in the woods near Hogsmeade. That could have been anything. You know what it was, Natsai. I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, mother. Careful? Officer Singer disagrees. She sent me an owl telling me that you have been trying to collect evidence of some kind against dark wizards. She berated me for not keeping a closer eye on you, and she is right. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. But mother! My little gazelle, you are well-intentioned, but you must not meddle in the affairs of dangerous people. If someone had meddled in Matabilaland, father would still be with us. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. My character just like... So <laughs> frustrating. <laughs> He's just smiling. <laughs> she never listens to me. Hi, Avi. She welcome. called you her little gazelle. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific to me. <sighs> I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade she mentioned. Self-transfiguration is not taught at Hogwarts, so I am gently discouraged from practicing it. However, I am an Animagus. And it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the highlands rather freely until now. Much to my mother's chagrin. That is how I managed to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. Totally not like anything unusual. In the Scottish Highlands, a gazelle hopping around just listening. Now the nickname makes sense. What an extraordinary ability to have. It is. I love transforming. But mother is less enthusiastic about it. Teach me. She says that no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has become so prevalent. True. <sighs> she claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. Hi, Shawnee. Hello, welcome in. Hi, Keeps.
The character looks like a friend of yours. Nice. <laughs> um. We're making good progress. We can't quit now. I agree. I have never considered quitting, even for a moment. You okay. could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Harlow, and Randrock were after you, but you did not. I choose to act as you have. I must deal with Rookwood and Harlow, not hide from them. <sighs> My mother cannot know where I am all the time. No, oh dear. Anne is getting worse. If there is any chance that the relic from Slytherin's spellbook can help her, I must find it. I'm oh. requesting your help. Meet me outside of Feldcroft, near the catacomb. Okay. Sebastian Quest it is. Maybe I'm learning more. More forbidden, unforgivable curses. Let's go. Can sight with the poachers. So the Hogwarts butchery. Feldcroft all the way here. Let's go. How are you doing, Avi? Hello. My foreign friends who study Finnish know it better than me because the grammar is so complex, like I don't know the rules. Tell them what lies in wait for me in there. You're here. Good. I am. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them. So I must assume it's still here. Hmm. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we've finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Probably was he's dropping again. Ominous would be again. livid if he knew what we were about to do. Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome to the lizards. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Let's go. It's all right, Liz. We forgive you. <laughs> Thanks. Doing great, Liz. Happy Sunday, everyone. To you as well. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Well, you don't hear me saying anything. Squish! At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. And the rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, spiders aren't insects. Don't start. <laughs> this works, this works, this works, this works. This, come on, this works. Ha, <laughs> it does work. <laughs> totally not what you're, what you're meant to do. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. Right. Accio. Opening all of these is tempting. Accio. We're here for a reason. I'd say Rebellion is justified. Nice try, JH. Welcome in. The world of another spider. I shall sleep better tonight. The pulse Out of the way. Rebellion. Oh, there's something behind there. Akio. Give me the loot. So I think we're supposed to go this way, right? Lucia's vibes, say? right? I nearly slipped there. I saw spooters. Attention. 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 
Bases. Bombarder. Bringo. Confringo. Bingo. Expelliarmus. Defender. Nice. Next achievement incoming. All this grass. It no longer feels like a tomb. I've read about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and ran into problems, often cave-ins, and then were abandoned. Exactly. We'll be fine, though. This is fine. Right, chat? This is fine. So, this was actually not the way, so I guess this is the way. That's the way, uh -huh, uh -huh, I like it. Now, this uh -huh, is the sort uh -huh. of great room I want to be buried in. Really? Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Lovely. <laughs> bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems. Is this what we gotta do? Rebellion. We're in a tomb. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. I don't remember which of these things were optional and which weren't. But I guess. There's something here by the altar. Oh, yeah, I remember. Accio! Indarium Leviosa! Okay, one more, I think. Revelio! Oh, there's a spooter inside. You can stay there. Accio! Hi, Buttercup! That's my second playthrough. On my first playthrough, I didn't even learn them. Nice. Oh, come on, Sebastian, move it! I foolishly mentioned the relic in my report and was reminded to leave it where it lay. But research must come before my fealty to the rules. I sense something about this relic. I was told that those chosen by English oak wands are powerful, have powerful intuition. I believe it. Therefore, when no one was looking, I acted. Con I conjured two barricades to isolate the relic. Ancestors, forgive me, but I used their very bones as the key. I plan to return to it, but first I must ready myself for our next assignment: learning the Imperius Curse. The spell is said to serve well against enemies. What did you find? Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student summary referenced the space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. I have the report if you want to have a look. Let's divide and conquer. You work <laughs> on sorting out the bone barricades, I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. My carriage is like, mm, I see where this is going. <laughs> um, are there any downsides of being evil, like being locked off from certain things or angry? Not to my knowledge so far, no. Um, hi, Jim. Hello. Hi, Cody. Good morning. And tech, 48 month resubscription. I think you are the longest subscriber on this server if i'm not wrong it's hard to believe it's been four years also feels like it was only yesterday i met you in chevy's chat so proud of where you are today and even though i can't be here as much as i would like i will always come back thank you tag for the kind words thank you for hanging out for such a long time four years sheesh thank you so so much you're basically one of the first subs i mean you have the founder badge so that says everything right damn thank you so so much welcome back to the junkies enjoy the emotes Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. I already opened the door. Can we go? Find the relic. Let's go. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. Okay, what? The student's diary mentions the Imperius Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. I prefer to learn the Imperius Curse. Yes, I'd like to learn the Imperius Curse. 
Oh, I prefer not to, okay. Yes, please, teach. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Hi, Joker. Focus Lockman. your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Whee! Here we go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. This is now a puppet master. <laughs> nice. Another barricade. Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. How gracious of you. Revelio. Mm, this one. This looks different than what we faced before. Now we're also dealing with rune symbols. Um, Accio. this one and this one that worked. Keep going. Rebellion Leviosa. Rebellion. This one has loot. Of course, Accio. we take this one as well. <laughs> loot, chat, yeah. loot. Hi, Jaxi. Hello. Revelio. And then we need this one. Um... Accio. Oh. Revelio. Did I take the wrong circle? Oh, it's already open. Oh, okay. Accio. Never mind. <laughs> there you go. Vaporize. Hi, Nebel. Welcome. You are head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. The speed of the spiders running around, right? Like frantic, completely nuts. I see why I mean, it's burning. So. Student was so entranced with this place. Curses. 
For a moment there, I thought that would never end. Shawnee, thank you for the two gifted subs. Thank you. Yes, Krummel. Yeah. Hi, Gravity. Let's craft the Tomb Raider. <laughs> um. How do those melon shrines with rocks on pillars work? Those rocks with symbols on them. You need a spell. You cannot use. You need a specific spell. Uh, if you don't have Flipendo, you can't do those yet. So you have to learn Flipendo first. Confringo. Revelio. Anything else in here? Nah. Okay. Hi, Kyle. Welcome. End. Lovely. All that for nothing. Oh, Hold God. on. Don't give up yet. Akio. Is this a Slytherin exclusive quest? No, it's a Sebastian side quest. You could do it as any, any character, I think. The relic contains abundant potential. Its possibilities could benefit not only wizard kind, but the world. But the dark sacrifice involves the real to realize its intent may be too great. Until we know more, please do not remove this relic. Sebastian, the relic, look. Could it be? <laughs> when Eric, crack a joke. Which cheese has the biggest muscles? Shred it. <laughs> The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. I'm willing to ignore what the journal entry says. We're taking the relic. Agreed. This is meant to be. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret. And there's Ominous already waiting for us. Is that? Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing. It was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine. But Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. Oof. Why would you leash? Hey. Hi, Simply. Hi, Drew. Good to see you. Hello. Hi, Cookie. Welcome in. How much did you hear? Everything. I heard you encourage Sebastian to take the relic. Sebastian's done his research. He knows what he's doing. Sebastian makes things sound easy when they could be impossible or dangerous. We need to stop him. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Very well, let's talk with Sebastian. I cannot side with you, Sebastian's right. Sebastian's right. We need that relic. I'm sorry, my mind is made up. Are you willing to sacrifice your friendship over this? I might be. How could I choose to stand by and watch him do this? What if the choice wasn't yours? You wouldn't be to blame for what happens. What in the world are you suggesting? Imperial! <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. <clears throat> what in the world are you suggesting, Imperio? Uh... Yes, that's probably what I'm suggesting. Never mind. Let's go, Imperial. That's what I'm saying. I would take all responsibility. This could save your friendship. Hi, Giddy. I know how to cast it. Sebastian taught me. Shawnee. But I won't do it unless you agree. This is insanity. I can't believe you would ask this of me. Sebastian is never going to give up trying to cure Anne. If you try and stop him now, he'll never forgive you. I'm... I... Fine. This is unfathomable. But I suppose if you want that responsibility, it may just save what is left of, of my friendship with Sebastian. Remember, this is what I was telling you about the Dark Arts. 
They come with a cost. You may well regret making this choice. Do what you have to do. Cast it. Before I change my mind. Imperio! Step aside, Ominous. Stay in place until we're out of sight. I will. Sebastian, come on. Wow, we were hyper right to welcome Shani. Thanks for the gift as up. Imperio, it was the only way to get out of here without a fight. Ominous, I'm sorry. Sebastian, we have to go. Move it. It's not unfathomable, it's unforgivable. <laughs> Did we do the wrong thing? You need the relic. I know. But not like this. Ominous and I agreed. Surely there's a difference between casting Imperio on someone without their knowledge and casting it with permission. I understand what you're saying. Revelio, I do, but... I've taken full responsibility. You have my word. And now move it. Imagine using a parry on people you love. We've mm. always looked out for each other, Ominous and I. I hope he knows that hasn't changed. Well, has it? Inconceivable. Hi, Batfish. Hi, Purple. Good morning to you as well. How long will the spell last? How long must Ominous stay in the tomb? The curse is lifted already. He'll easily find his way out of the catacomb just as we did. He'll be all right, Sebastian. Return to Falcroft? Okay, let's go. I mean, Imperio is, is horrible and not moral to do, but it's not hurtful, is it? Like, it's not, unless you tell them to hurt themselves. I think it's just feeling weird, if I remember correctly, but it's not really painful. Uh-oh, smoke. Smoke! I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks um, like ominous. Sebastian? It only upset her. Sebastian, you see this? Oh no, this isn't good. No. What is it? Smoke, over there, by the hamlet. Move it, move it, move it! Feldkopf's in trouble. They're under attack. Hey, Buttercup, I'm That's from hard. Northern Germany, but I'm living in Switzerland. We're good. Good well lurking. Ah! Thanks for the five gifted subs. Thank you so much.
Kill. Boy. Boy. What have you done? Saved my sister. With an unforgivable curse. From that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. What did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. Since we're a bad character? You did what you had to do. If I have to keep proving that to my uncle, I will. He cannot banish me from my own home. From my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. Thanks for the follows. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Thanks for the follows, Goodwill Lurkin. Thanks for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you. Shawnee, thanks for the gifted subs as well. Guys, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Um, okay. The uncle is cool killing the goblins, but not the goblin killing himself. <laughs> well, it what isn't. What was he thinking? I think the issue is that it's an illegal, an illegal spell. And he could just. It could have just used glaciers, arrest of momentum, uh, depulso, anything really. Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian saved his sister. Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. Erin. Miss Rumley does not resort to using dark magic even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Why, Sebastian? Some promising news about the location of our Hebridean dragon friend and where to return her, you know what. Meet me in the town circle in Hogsmeade. It's like a place right out of a storybook. <laughs> um, Erdem, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. I hope you like the emotes. I made them myself and enjoy the ad free watching. Thank you. And uh, Sekhmet, I hope I said that correctly. Probably not. Thank you very much for the uh, Prime sub. Thank you so much, guys. Everybody, thank you, thank you. Can you crucio the uncle? I don't think so. Thank you very much for the first time subs, guys. All the chunky chunks in chat to welcome them. Speak for Sebastian in the Undercroft. Uh, in the Undercroft. So we go back to Hogwarts. And then uh, here... Uh, Hi Twism, no I haven't played any Borderlands games. I've played Telltale Borderlands for a little bit, but I haven't finished it. And that was before I was streaming. Hi Nuxarius, hello. Hey Scales, hi Benz, welcome in. <laughs> Constable and David, <laughs> you too. Mm. The irony, yeah. <laughs> Did you speak with my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. 
I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form, and that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne, to reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. I'll Hi, send Zohar. you an hour Welcome when in. I have news. Hi, Mama Coyote. Hello. What's wrong with Anne again? Uh, Anne was cursed. And apparently they're, they can't find any any cure for the curse. So they're kind of desperate. Wait, before we do this, I have lots of challenges, I think. Well, maybe not lots, but a few that I have finished. Um, hmm. Okay. Exploration. What do we have here? Okay. Okie dokie. Hi, color bots. Hello. Hi, white people. <laughs> hello. Paquito, hello. Good morning. Uh... Ah, yeah, the dragon egg. I think I'm going to do the dragon quest with Poppy again. I really like Poppy in her quest line. So. We have some unidentified gear. Okay. Nah. Uh. Which one did I have before? I think this one. Yeah, that's fancy. Fancy schmancy. Ooh, hello. I mean, it's just... Oh, God. It's just one point more, but... Every point counts. Let's go. Okay. Lick a toad. Thank you for the 10-month reason with Prime. Enjoy the emotes and the entry watching. How you, how you doing? And thanks everybody for the follows. Welcome to the lizards. Nice to have you. So, what did I say? Hi, Joey. Hello. Gobbledygook. Or a poached egg. Talk to Poppy and Hogsmeade. Yeah, let's do that first. We go to Hogsmeade, sell some gear, and then uh, we go meet Poppy. Welcome in, guys. Since when is magic dark and light? Magic is just bad the if they are misused. True, but apparently... I mean... The thing is... Why the unforgivable curses are unforgivable is because they literally have just one purpose. While you can use all the other spells... Well. Do you let me know if I can be of any You can use them for killing if necessary, but it's not their sole purpose, right? Avada Kedavra, sole purpose, killing. Um, Imperial, sole purpose, to mind control. Cruciatus, sole purpose is to... Oh, damn it, I forgot about these two. Sole purpose is to... I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. You know, they always have just one purpose, while all the other spells can be used for multiple things. Ah, oh, damn it, level three. You'll see it was a mistake. It's a Malatagarian. <laughs> no. It's not like her to forget. I didn't keep you waiting, did I? Not at all. I was just at the post office. Gran told me to expect a package, but it looks as if she forgot to send it. She didn't send me an owl this week either. Perhaps she's busy with her research. What did you find out about the dragon you were tracking? I realized that she didn't know the poachers had her egg, so when she left Horntail Hall, she would have headed straight to her nest. I went back to the tent and tracked her flight. Well done. 
You certainly know what you're doing. I can't be certain, but I have an idea of one place she may have been heading. I thought we might go and see it for ourselves. Let's of go. course. Shall we leave now? If that's all right, I want to see how she's faring if she had a collar on. And she's likely frantic about her egg. Oh, cut. Sudden cut. Here we are. I do think this is where we'll find her. The terrain's typical of where the breed would nest. I suspect it's how the poachers found her to begin with. They likely camped here and logged her patterns. Perhaps nabbed her first and then her egg. Dragons are hard enough to wrangle, let alone maternal ones. You got all of that from simply standing here? You'd be surprised how easy it is to think like a poacher. Shall we see if she's home? We only need to return her egg. That sounds straightforward enough. We should be in mm. and out. Then we can be finished with the poachers Ooh. once and for all. Should. Stretch and a hot tub. Sheesh. Everything at once. Let's find our dragon then. Okay. Thanks for the stretch. Stretch in the hot tub. Let's go. <laughs> well then. Let's find our dragon and return her egg. Wonderful. If she sees us flying about, she might take it as a sign of aggression. Or Berry. We should stay on foot. Oh, and one more thing. Let's not agitate her. Goodness knows she's been through enough already. I'm ready when you are. I'm already at it. Hi, Berry. Hi, Senti. There she is. Above us. She did make it home safely. It looks as if she wasn't collared like the other dragons. Or she was shaking up, shaking up, 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 bow. Okay, let's go. I have some eggs Poor here for you. Must be worried sick, wondering what happened to her egg. Poor thing. I need to watch Sweeney Todd again. Such a good movie. For what it's worth, she doesn't hey, seem smoke. to have spotted us yet. Sorry, Poppy. What? <laughs> At least ten usual. <laughs> they look funny when they when they get petrificus. How charming. They keep in touch with each other. The poachers. Hi Adela, welcome. Kalisi? <laughs> Dracaris. Ooh. Shivers the storyline when you do an evil playthrough? Mm, hardly. Not really at all. So far, at least. Ribera. Fantastic. There she is again. She's breathtaking. <laughs> From a distance. No, you are. Smell a cocoa on the horizon. Yeah, after the hot tub. Maybe I maybe I can get to the to the egg thing I in time. How good her eyesight is. I beg your pardon. <laughs> I don't imagine the poachers fed her well, and from a distance, we probably look exactly like sheep to her. How lucky for us. Poppy, come here, move it. Move your invisible booty. Next to the dragon said Dracaris. <laughs> Man, I want to watch the show again. Game of Thrones, but in English. It would be my first time watching it in English. Watch your step. I think Poppy didn't skill that you could sprint when you're, um... When you're, uh, concealed. 
pity. She must have been starved to pick off a grapple. Or just raring for a fight. Oh, the grapple. I forgot about the crap horn. Oh man, it looks so tiny, but when you fight it, right, later, then oh my god. Coin, what was that? This makes no sense to use disillusionment and like then unhide. Hi, Iluka. Hi, Supreme. Wait here. I'll run ahead. For some reason, he just stops. Why does he stop walking? I'll just follow when it's safe. I don't understand this. I don't understand why he's, like, cowering so much. <laughs> it's not making any sense to me. Oh, hot jump over. Easy. It's a little too warm, if you ask me. <laughs> I don't suppose she listened to reason. If we can get to that... <laughs> She's leaving! Quickly! Yeah, yeah, I'm running, I'm running! I'm running, I'm running, I'm running! There's the nest. We're almost there. Okay, let's go then. Gotta repair this again. Because there's a big dragon poppy, maybe that's why. Now, if we just return her egg, we can hopefully make it out without too much fuss. Yeah, let's see about that. Hi, Shawoy, hello. Hi, Giants. Dragon. Good dragon. <laughs> that was brilliant. And did you see how clever? She left us perfectly unharmed. I don't know if that was clever <laughs> from her perspective. She tried to kill us. That's rather generous, isn't it? She did try to kill us the entire time. Only until she saw her egg, at which point I thought she rather warmed to us. The important thing is that we survived it and we returned her egg. Thank you for doing this with me. <laughs> Wouldn't blame you one bit if you wanted to head back to the castle and never think about dragons again. Shall we head back? I'm ready if you are. I am. After our dragon rescue at Hauntel Hall, I half expect to be ambushed by poachers any time I'm not in the castle. Mm. Understandable. We did sabotage their fighting ring and steal a dragon egg from them. True. True. So why haven't they come after us? It's not like them to let things lie. Unless... Unless what? Unless they haven't let things lie. Oh no, I can't believe I didn't see it. We need to leave. I need to send an owl. Okay, let's move. Hi, Fallen. I play on PC. What do you mean? Sure, she wanted us to warm the entire time. Yeah. <laughs> Be cool to ride the dragon. I was hoping that we could jump on the dragon and then fly out of the tent. I've been so blind. Okay, guys. Another quest done and done. 
Oh, and another skill. Nice. So, uh, Twitch is gonna run an ad in five minutes, and I will take this moment to take a short break, make a hot cocoa, and then I'll be right back. I'm gonna play my Dead Space 1 remake uh, playthrough comp clip compilation, and as I said, I will run ads now, so we don't have any interruptions during the actual gameplay, so you guys without a sub don't miss anything. I see you afterwards. Have fun. See ya. Content warning. Read before playing. Dead Space contains graphic violence, including explicit depiction of dismemberment. Nice. My favorite. Uh oh. Why do I hear the pounding? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh my fucking god, Quali. <laughs> what the worst possible moment to bring me a tea. <laughs> My heart! I'm just shooting a multi limbed malaka and Quali's coming like, Tee! Just the bag jamming. Nice. Oh. oh, there's more. We done? Oh, no, we're not done. Oh, no! Ow! Oh, this game is so awesome. Wait, I blew this guy up. Where's my loot? Pick a poo? Okay, this scared me for a second. Okay, what the <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? It's so dark. Oh my god, this is the darkest game I've ever played. What the fuck? Mama. <sighs> what? You cannot take the. T oh, look at him. He's so adorable, though. It's a... He looks like Chonky Cool. Do I have that emote on my thingy, my bobs? Here, he looks like him. He looks like Chonky with a leather jacket. Why is he so adorable? <laughs> <laughs> Can you buy this plushie somewhere? How do you guys like the mid-air Isaac twerk? Boop -doop -boop -boop -boop. Boop -doop -boop -boop -boop. My money don't jiggle jiggle. Off, fight. Isaac, Is it no having snoo snoo over there? there? Is if I use the ADS cannons, manual targeting like before. I can shoot it right off the hull. I got this. You Bruh. <laughs> oh god. Quali best jump scare of the game. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> oh man, he's really good at that. <laughs> it became a baby! How does, how does that work? Are we good? Are we safe? Is he dead? Are you dead? Oh my god. Okay, wait, I need to let off some steam. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sudden anger Such outburst. <laughs> twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Content warning. 
Read before playing. Dead Space contains graphic violence, including explicit depiction of dismemberment. Nice. My favorite. Uh oh. Why do I hear the pounding? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Oh my fucking god, Quali! <laughs> moment to bring me a tea. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my heart. I'm just shooting a multi-limbed malaka and Quali's coming like tea. Hi guys, I'm back. Hello. <clears throat> Guess you were done dragging, dragging that egg around. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, Cynical Sage, for the 20 month reset. That's crazy. Sheesh, 20 months. Holy moly, that's such a long time. Darwin. Darwin's a cat. <laughs> Thank you so much for the first time shop with Prime. Enjoy the emotes and the ad free watching. Thank you very much. Amadal, hello. Hi, Vegan Ember, hello. Jax, welcome in. Welcome in, everybody! So, where was I? We got a new talent. I said I would like... This, maybe? Thank you for all the follows as well. Thank you, Consti. Thank you, David. Um, so an enemy under your control with Imperial Curses, other targets with each successful strike is pretty good. Um, cursed effect remains on enemies. I think this is good for first step. And then I would get this one and this one the moment that I can. Which I hope is soon. So, what did I want to do now? Did I already decide something? Thank you, mods. I enjoyed your on the break video. If you want to watch it fully, or you probably want, uh, probably went through an entire time, but if you want more of these type of videos, here's my YouTube channel where you can see um, the one with the hyper uh, chunky emote and the heart. Um, follow me on YouTube, that one, the TTV list one. That is where I have song covers and clip compilations of clips that you guys made. Gobbledygook, this is what I wanted to do next, exactly. So speak with the meat. Goblin mine south of Hogwarts. First I have to ask Hamid, right? Or no? Oh no, okay. Hogwarts it is. Ah oh, yeah, first I have to ask Hamid, right? The full version of you getting a huge scare there? No. <laughs> but if you want to watch the whole VOD thing, then you can go to my VOD channel. I have three YouTube channels. <laughs> and um, one is for clip compilations and song covers. That was my first YouTube channel. As a Dalian key, I wonder where it might lead me. We are gonna smack a key. Um, and then I have another one where I store my past There's broadcasts, which is relatively How new. How do I get this key in there? And then I have one for YouTube Shorts, which are TikTok videos. Got it. An old coin. Perhaps coin. Nelly knows what it means. Massive coin. <laughs> Cynical, hi! Enjoying the streams. Thank you so much for the two-month reset. Welcome back to the Chonkies. I hope you're doing good. Hi, Nay. Welcome. Hello, hello. Out of the way. I need to go to Amit. Amit! I need your gobbledygook expertise. <laughs> hello. Hello there. Hello, I'll meet. Do I recall you saying no. that you speak gobbledygook? I, I did. I mean, I do. Speak it. Is this to do with the goblin I saw you with in Hogsmeade? 
It is. His name is Lodgok. We could use your help with something. He's waiting for me near a goblin mine. Would you be willing to help? Of course. How exciting. I mean, well, might this be dangerous? I think he simply wants to show me something that involves gobbledygook. If it helps, he's a friend of Serona's. Good to hear. Good to hear. If Serona trusts him, then I feel much better. Dead Zombie Hunter, thanks for the bits. Thank you so much. Hi, Julius. How are you doing? Um, let's head to the uh, mine then. is waiting. Should we go? Of course. I just want to check the pronunciation of a couple of key terms first. So I will meet you there. A couple? <laughs> I just want to check the pronunciations of a couple. Key terms there. Oh, the voice crack. Oh, I love Amit's voice crack there. Beautiful. Meet Lord Gok near the mine entrance. Okay, let's go. A world map. Let's go. Dead zombie hunters continuing the gifts up they got from Gritty. Hey, thank you so much, dead zombie hunter. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I hope you enjoy the emotes and now fully voluntarily being a chonky. Uh, Sunday chillaxing day, feeling very 69% sus. <laughs> oh, nice. Meet Lodgok near the mine entrance. Oh, it's literally there. I just wanted to jump on my broom. Hi, Lodgok. A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here? Of course. Unfortunately, presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Urtgot did not have the effect I'd hoped. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. Mm, but you had no choice. You should have expected that. Yeah. You said this would repair the chasm between the two of you. How did you not expect him to react this way? I'm afraid we do not have the luxury of rational expectation when it comes to Ranrock. Hmm. Damn Bragbor and his blasted journals. Bragbor? An ancestor of Ranrock's, renowned metal worker. If we are to work together, I suppose I must tell you more. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbor's journals. They described repositories that Bragbor had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle. That is where we began our search. Why does Ranrock care so much about these repositories? He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Ranrock was convinced that the repositories contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to take it for goblin kind. But he's... Here comes my friend Armit. Probably best to continue our conversation later. Greetings, Lord Gok. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. Oh, Bacalio. Enough. <laughs> Please do not tell me that was meant to be gobbledygook. I, um, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it? I can, Sir Lodgok. Just Lodgok. Thankfully, we only need someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. What written plans? And why can't you come with us? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. Oh, I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. 
And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ranrock. All you need to do is not be seen, either by the eye above the enchanted door or a loitering loyalist. Okay, um, Drew, thank you very much for the 100 biddies. And Ashgoth, thank you for the gifted sub to Shaoi. Shaoi, enjoy the emotes. Ashgoth, how are you still awake, my friend? Aren't you sleepy? Um, hi, Saeed, hello. Hi, Super Pants. <laughs> thank you very much. Glad you like it here. Uh, Ashgoth, the legend again, right? Okay, we're ready. I'll meet and I can do this. I will await your return. I shall see you soon. Hi, Scythe Day, hello. Okay, enter the goblin mine. I meet you coming. There you go. Let's go. The door is looking at us. Oh. He <laughs> sneaky. Thanks for the follows, everybody. Welcome. Hi, Rhino. So rarely prepare one for reality. A real goblin mine. It's even grander than I had expected. Unless I had a nap, then the cat woke me up. Ugh, blasted cats. <laughs> I cannot believe I met a goblin. Let's just learn what we can to get out. Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple a device. Impressive workmanship aside, it's the only way forward. I meet you, okay? I still can't believe we're inside a real goblin mine. Akio. Yay, give me the loot. Give me the loot. Nice. Thank you very much. Okay, on we go. I've read about mines like this, but seeing one is something else altogether. Oh, I can practice my curses a bit more. Wow, wow, wow. You I'll get you through this one. Oh, little moon calf. Far from home, eh? Does Hogwarts have a grapple? Who's there? Curse Sheesh. I've been fighting since before. No! Fight him! Oh, there we go. Take him! 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 Take I have to say, fighting in this game is so satisfying. Oh, I really do enjoy it a lot. We're being watched by a door. Yeah, I know. I was looking around. Hi, Lord Shiny. Welcome in. Uh, I am level... Level, 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 level 27. And uh, it's my second playthrough. I'm a Ravenclaw at heart, actually, but I wanted to learn everything and I was uh, refusing to learn the curses on my first playthrough. So I figured for my, um, for my second playthrough I will do a character where it fits more. Oh man, how does this... Ah, it doesn't matter. I feel like a character from one of the adventure books I read during the summer holidays. 
Uh, Enrico, there's it. no more drops. See if we can find any plans. The developers don't have drops Bound active anymore. Plans around here somewhere. A schematic. They're building something. I can't quite make it out. Curious. I will get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. Okay, good. Good to know. I didn't think this game would be good. I'm glad I was wrong. <laughs> Pleasant surprise, huh? Revelio. I like the game too. Hmm, I think I need to go back and look around there first. <laughs> I just noticed when when I say Malaka, uh, my character is called Malaka, so I'm becoming a Pokemon, kind of. Fascinating to see gobbledygook written in a goblin hand. The flourishes are extraordinary. There must be more notes around here. What could they be building? Revelio. You are such a nerd, Amit. Such a nerd. <laughs> Which is nothing bad. I like nerds. This, um... If I'm translating this correctly, and I think Nerd. that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to Lodgok empty-headed. Isn't it empty-handed? But empty-headed also fits, right? Reminds me of the time I nearly fell out of a car. Expelliarmus. Oh, little no. car. Oh, oh, what are you coming to? Boiler. This place is more complex than I had expected. <laughs> well, surprise! Again! Hi, Otto. Hello. Hi, Eamon. Charlotte, hello. <laughs> Glad to hear, Charlotte. Ding, ding! Such a satisfying sound to hear, right? When you pick up the potions. Ding, ding! Hi, Eternal Noob. The, the title helps with all the questions. Or the pinned message, the frequent we frequently asked questions. Another schematic. What are they going to build? This mine is too small for whatever it is. 
Hi, Chad. Um, English only, please. Welcome in. So, was there anything here? Or was it just blocked off? Uh huh. Okay. Just a little bit of loot. Nice. Yeah, this was the way, right? Something through here? Ah, here. Oh, there you go. I was like, hmm, damn, did I do wrong? Hi, Extralas. Uh, hi, Liz. I do enjoy this game and your playthrough, too. And also, I tried to improve my English skill. Nice. You're doing very well, I would say. Good job. Devil snare. Lumos. Nasty stuff if we're not careful. Not an entanglement we need right now. <laughs> When I was starting the game and I could read that I conjure, can conjure uh, my own potion pot and stuff, my, my own cauldron, I was thinking maybe that I could conjure a, a little um, cauldron and then I could sit down wherever I want and then make my own, my own potions, you know. I was a bit surprised that it then was just locked to, to the room of requirement. Super sneak, super sneak. I have the power of super sneak. What's that? Who's there? Nobody. Hi, Shishito. Hello. That should be the last of them, I'll meet. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to curse I more. Feel. Oh, it's not, um... It's not lit yet? Or what's the issue? Skinning, skinning, um, 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 um... Was it just... Is it already open? Do I just have to hide and then I can go through? Ah, oh, it's just a little extra area for this. Okay, never mind. But yeah, I, I'm okay just to continue like this. I know there's many areas that I'm leaving out right now, but I said I'm gonna focus on main this quest. This is not good. They're building enormous drills, bigger than this mine could contain. Let's get out of here and tell Lobcock what we found. Mm, hey Chad, is Petrificus Totalis kind of a one hit? Um, it can be, for most e uh, enemies it is a one hit, but if you, there's a few powerful enemies, like bosses, so to say, and they have higher health bars. I one-shot a boss already once, but um, it's not guaranteed. It must be a quicker way out of here than retracing our steps. Akio! There's one of these, um, poacher guys. Like a, I don't know, like a torturer or something like this. I don't, I forgot the name. But they're, they're never a one hit. Not even a two hit. <laughs> they're super powerful. Must be the wind. I need a moment to catch my breath. This was more than I bargained for. I'm glad you came with me, Amit. Now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. <laughs> Your English sounds very fine to me. <laughs> you can hear typing them. Um, hi, Melon, by the way. Hi, Service. Hello. It's wanted for everyone named Neville. Ah, No bully, Neville! Um, 
Revelio. Oh yeah, this was the way out. Let me just quickly... Let me just quickly have a peek here. Ha! Alohomora. Executioner, thank you, Christus. Yeah, that's just, that's the one. That's the one. Hi, Indigo. Welcome into the stream. Lamfrino, good morning. How are you doing? Hello. Okay. Revelio. Are we good? We good. Okay, let's go. So now we drop down here. We're back in the end. Look, the lift. A welcome sight indeed. I think this could be confusing if people are not paying attention to the surroundings and they're easily distracted um, and or like getting lost in the environment and can't recognize uh, places they've been to earlier. This could have been a misleading line, right? Look, the lift. We're almost out of here. Sounds like, hey, we just need to use the lift and then we're out of here. <laughs> What's the reason for Lux if there's a Lohomora? Because not everybody knows a Lohomora. That's the reason, I guess. Also, there's stronger locks. And you need really good a Lohomora. There are locks that I can't open. Um, can we please talk about what just happened? Okay. That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. For a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. <laughs> I couldn't have done it without you. Now... If you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lodgok. Understood. I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secrets are safe with me, but I get to write the book about this escapade someday. Without further ado, adieu. Adieu. Uh, Imikal. Ima Imikai? I don't know how to pronounce it. Hi. <laughs> I get lost looking for loot. Yeah, that happens. Hi, Strictly. English only, I mean. <laughs> nice. They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Ranrock must be searching for the repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however, I do not know where else he plans to search. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So I was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. When she looked up, I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. Without a moment's hesitation, she smiled and asked me to sit with her. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small, oddly shaped container with a strange symbol on it. She was certain it was made of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Miriam. Yes. But how did you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research. And I know of the container. Ah. The reverence with which she talked of goblins and their intelligence and skill, it caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways with her promising to share what she'd learned. More of Ranrock's recruits arrived and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Ranrock was thrilled with our discovery. 
but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch. And I heard she had been killed. You think Ranrock murdered her? I don't want to believe it. But I don't know. After that, something shifted in me. I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock, transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lord Gok, for telling me this. Mm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor, at some point, built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl. You made me want a hot chocolate, so I made myself one with cream and marshmallows on top. Enjoy, enjoy. And welcome into the stream. Hey, Swan, welcome. Hi, Ghost George, good to see you. I like your sweater. Thank you. Hi, Cinder. To be super nerdy, color portals is a spell that locks doors. Alomora is the counter charm, so only doors that have been locked with color portals can be unlocked with Alomora. Huh. So the, the so the locks that we see, they're actually not really there. They're a charm, basically. Uh, in the Dark Arts build, is the Dark Arts build easier to progress through fights? Hmm, I don't know if I can just say that like this. It does help a lot if you skill it properly, I would say. It's, it's possible. You have some really overpowered skill sets. I can show you in a bit. Hang on. Just looking for possible better gear. I mean, I play on a higher difficulty now than I did on my first playthrough, which was a normal. I cannot say if I just got better with all the button combos and, and stuff now, or maybe it's not that big of a difference, the difficulty from normal to hard. Um, or is it really the spells, but I just learned Crucio yesterday, and today I learned Imperio, so I wouldn't say so. Hmm. How many hours in the story uh, line plus minus? Um, this is the fourth day that, we, that we're playing this. And I mainly do the things that I have to do. Maybe 20, 23 hours, roughly. Hi, Physics. And Flo, thank you for the 12 months. I know I might be your eternal lurker, but damn, I am not sorry for joining that random cyberpunk stream one year ago and became part of the Chonkies. Oh my god. Flo, thank you so much for the 12 months resubscription. Thank you for being around for an entire year. I'm also glad you joined us on that cyberpunk stream. And I can't wait to do cyberpunk again when the DLC comes out. Enjoy the emotes and the every watching and thank you so much for your support. <clears throat> is that alert from Yona Yinton? No, uh, that is inspired by Yona Yinton, but I sing it myself. That's my own voice that you hear in the alert. It's called Kulning. But if you know Yona Yinton, then you probably know what Kulning is anyway. Um. Oh yeah, we could do man. Uh, we can do a manual save. You're right. 20 hours, it says. Okay. So, quests. What can I do? The Dalian Keys in the Shadow of the Mine meets Sebastian. Yeah! Maybe we learn Avada Kedavra now. Ooh!
Yeah, but probably for game design it was better to obviously show which doors are locked. Yeah, I agree. It's probably the reason. Are you going to play the other houses? I already played... Um, I already played as Ravenclaw. That was my first and very thorough playthrough. Almost 100%ed it. Um, I will eventually do all the other houses as well, but I think... I think I'm gonna do something else after this playthrough. I'm a variety streamer and if I'm playing one game for too long, I'm, I'm a bit like, ugh. So eventually I will also do Hufflepuff and Gryffindor. Hi, Sarge, Dwayne, hello, Silver Fox. I thought my owl might pique your interest. Do you do most of the side quests? I do some, but not most of them. I try to focus on the main story because this is my second playthrough and we just, we played, what, 80 hours, 90 hours as a Ravenclaw and almost 100%ed it. And then I took a sh short break of four streams, played Sons of the Forest, and now we're back at this. So yeah, I have the itch to play something new. <laughs> I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied by all that happened with Ominous and the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranrock's loyalists. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I've no idea, but perhaps they're searching it the way they did Brookwood Castle and Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? We need to see what they're doing. I say we take them head on. Let's bury some enemies. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. Hi, Kenny. Welcome. After you. And thanks for the follow. Reach the entrance to the mine. Let's go. Hi, Adultia. Hello. There they are up ahead. I'll let you lead. Any who oppose no one enters this mine. Kill anyone who tries. Renrock's loyalists are out of blood. Is who is it? I know I heard something that time. Is somebody there? No. Hello? I don't know what you're talking about, mate. Someone there. Hello? <laughs> All of Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. Thanks, mate. Very good, very nice. <laughs> We can almost see Lissa's spells through the jumper. <laughs> this is going well. Oh man. We make a good team. That's we do at that. That's why I don't have the like a proper Slytherin outfit, right? Because if Once I would again, have a green tie. We can fight our way through or be discreet. You know which one I'd choose. Oh, I could fall dead asleep on my feet. I could. You're making this too easy. <laughs> Let's go. That's rather satisfying to blow them up like this. Rather up wise coming back this way. Mm. Oh, 69 of 100 goblins killed. Nice. Can I get some 69 in chat, guys? 69. I find the gear upgrade system a bit strange. I mean, most people don't even complete the game by the time they're 40, and it's pretty easy to find better gear. Um, you mean like the literal upgrades, right? 
Where the hell did you come from, little guy? Did you come here? And the fun sneaking around has its fun is a relative term. <laughs> it is. And that was relatively fun. Is there anything else up here? Revelio. Oh wow, there's a big chest that I almost missed. Sheesh. All the 69s. Hi, Parcival. Hi, Raging Coffee. Hi, the seventh witcher. Good to see you again. How's it going? Hey, crazy glitch. And Glocky. Why 40 is the max, uh, the, the level cap. You cannot. I should tell you. Skull Rumor further. is this mine was closed long Rumor ago due to it. an infestation of spiders. How oh. nice. How nice. <laughs> Let's go in. Let's get some spiders. What is your favorite, um... For better or for worse. When you guys play this, what is your favorite to fight? Wait, did I knock him down there? Are you stuck? Oh, you teleported out. Okay, cool. Uh, this is one of my favorites. Oh, this mine looks like a tomb. It was closed after accidents were reported. Now oh, I see sweet. why. Good for you. What the hell? <laughs> I sometimes don't understand this. Like, was I too far away? What the? Rebellion. Confringo. I gotta try this again. Did I not do the exact same thing as before? Maybe he suddenly had a weakness in his knee, or God, God knows what. Fatality. Gravity wins. In these webs. Too disgusting for even a spider to prey on. Wow. Not your best moment. <laughs> no! Loyalists are in here. Yes, <sighs> too many. They definitely think there's something here they want. Akio, we got it, Leviosa. Maybe the cutwet hadn't fully burned away or something. Oh, weird. Um, hi, Bandersnatch. Snatch. I had some IRL work, so just turned in. How's it going? It's going good. Apart from my PC blue Still screening earlier. Spiders give people goosebumps. Could be the hairy legs, or the solar size, or the venomous fangs, or any number of endearing qualities, really. I like spiders. They're okay. But toads. <laughs> Horrible abominations. This way. Ha. I want to fight a troll or something. Give, give me a troll. Should have thought to conjure stairs. Repair. Level are you? 27. Hi. Never skip ledge day. <laughs> ledge day, nice. Okay. 
Okay. This wants a troll. She must have flipendo. <laughs> yes, I do. I feel like they don't really give you. If you focus on the main quest, they don't give you many trolls, do they? There's so many trolls if you fight. Uh, if you if you play everything, there's so so many. In the side quest, and if you do the main quest only, this are you hardly any encounter uh, encounter any trolls. Sporter. Oh, she has the red glow. Bombarda. Expelliarmus. Uh. Couldn't bring them. Come on, why doesn't. You can't burn this away, huh? I was trying to burn the, the thingy away. That doesn't work. Okay. Oh. Screw gravity. Wait, what did I see here? Ah, more loot. No troll oh, in this quest. quick work of them. Professor Hecate would be proud. Lumos. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists have all but declared war. Hello, chest. You're mine. Hi. Bedhaver? Akio. Wasn't there a second one? Still not seen a single room. I think we're going more to be a bit world. distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction at that. We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? Bring me a dozen humans to battle. I'll take I only had to five, fight five trolls in independently for quest to finish the challenge in both playthroughs. Uh, I just wanted to pop in and say how much I love your voice. You sound wonderfully when you sing. Thank you very much, Wukong. Thank you. Appreciate that. We have a song unlocked, if I'm not wrong. One less human to worry about. I was trying to focus on... Man. Incendio. Defender. 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 
Slytherins are teeming with it. And we're much more fun to fight with. Confringo. And you're totally not full of yourself. <laughs> we're so much better than Gryffindors. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Now. Uh, we can have a rune symbol above the cavern door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Confringo! This is just decoration? Okay. So we have. Uh... Oh, we can roll a potion. This. Ah, up there it was. I wouldn't be surprised to find a couple more room things. Wasn't expecting that. No. Uh, hi Irish, welcome. It's magic, not a bug. Hey, ate all the caviar, welcome in. The world floated back to me as if in a watery haze. How long had I been unconscious? I only remember his eyes, empty, empty of sorrow, yes, but also... I recall feeling a sense of euphoria as I watched the pain vanish. But then everything started to turn. When I fell, I must have hit my head. I neither feel nor see a mark, but the pain is throbbing. I can see... I can only hope it is not the Black Death. At least he is no longer in pain. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. Hi, Dee Dee. Welcome. We are better than the Griffs. <laughs> Hi, Banana. Welcome. Hi, Bleep. Hi, Sidepipes. Hello. Welcome to the streams, everybody. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols and ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. This place is odd, to be sure, but I'm fascinated by it. Now, for the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. <laughs> Found it! <laughs> is that guy Podrick from Game of Thrones? <laughs> Maybe it is. Welcome in Insomnia, hi. And now for the moment of truth. It I'm gonna has make to fit. Ooh, I'm gonna make hot cocoa with whiskey today. You know what I really like? Hot cocoa with um amaretto. Which is this almond marzipan tasting liquor. I really like it. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. The bad news? And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. Nice! More trouble! I like trouble. <laughs> I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mar and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time, we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? Someone who knows Ranrock personally. They asked me not to mention their name to anyone. A goblin? Tell me I'm wrong. You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, 
But not all goblins are... Not all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? You're not thinking straight. You don't know what you're saying. Take a breath for a moment. Oh, I know precisely what I'm saying. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> These fucks in this game, man. Can somebody clip that, please? <laughs> I hope Professor Fee. I believe my next broom upgrade to be even more impressive than the last. Come by Spin Witches as soon as you can. I'm on my way immediately. Ah. <laughs> oh. Do I not have this as quest yet? Hmm. Hi, Cammy. A little Irish jig. <laughs> you got completely mad. <laughs> Hi, Jerry. Welcome. Speak to the portrait of Professor Neve Fitzgerald in the map chamber. Uh, well, I wanted to do the quest with the. Oh, the sky's the limit. That's the one, right? Yeah, let's go. Okay, so we go to Hogsmeade. River dance. Actually, as a kid, uh, we had the we had a cassette for for a river dance. The music was great and the dancing was cool too. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? <sighs> and chat, does it? Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? I remember playing. Hello again. Wonderful to see you. As before, I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. Yeah, and I gotta pay for it. <laughs> You'll 4, be thrilled with that cheese. broom, I promise you. Oh wait, why are we Thanks already for talking? By. You're all set with the new upgrade. I can't wait to hear what you think. <clears throat> this may sound presumptuous, but you'd like me to report back with even more flight details. Yes. <laughs> you know me well. I feel I'm almost there. I just think I can improve broom flight a bit more. Miss Ray's is running a time trial at the South Coast course. Not ideal, really, what with rumors of Ranrock's lot and Ashwinder's infiltrating the place. However, if you're flying high above them, you should be all right, I think. Uh, I think. They don't scare me. I'm not worried, Mr. Weeks. I'll see if I can find a Melda. I hope you are able to complete these trials. I have a feeling this final upgrade is going to be a sweeping success. <laughs> Do be careful, of course. <laughs> I shall look forward to hearing from you soon. I look forward to our next meeting. Can you buy my what stuff? What are we looking for today? Money. Money! Thanks for the follows, everybody. We passed the 46,000 lizards. Just now. Thank you so much, everybody who's part of this. Appreciate you. Okay. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Thanks for taking all my crap. <laughs> Seems like all roads lead to Hogsmeade, right? Let's, what will be your next game? I was actually um, wondering if you guys would be interested in participating. Um, I was wondering if you guys would be willing to participate in a poll so I could get an idea of what you guys would like to watch. Thanks for the hug, Egdemus. Hi, second. A poll? A poll, yeah. Oh, that's a long way to go, though. Speak with Imelda Rise. Who's Paul? <laughs> That's a running joke. Castle Ruins converted from a Prime sub to a Tier 1 sub. Yo, let's go. Thank you so much. Thank you very, very, very much for that. I appreciate that. Enjoy the emotes. Outlast 1. <laughs> this audio is better. Not sure if Hobby's still playing game. Already having schnoo with the noises he makes. What? 
What? I will try it with Amaretto another time, must buy it first. It's really, it's really good. Cocoa with Amaretto is really nice. Bot? What's with the bot? Is the bot not working? Do you want to pull here now? I can help. Oh, wait. Yeah, so... Uh, wait, let me, let me... Oh, I don't have the thingy anymore. Sheesh. So, I was thinking the games that I could play next-ish after this, because Resident Evil 4 is coming out in the end of March, right? So I'm definitely going to drop everything to play Resident Evil 4 when I can. And I was thinking four games. Uh, Marvel Spider-Man, the remastered version. I have that one, never played it. Um, Days Gone, never played that. Kingdom Come Deliverance, never, ne never played that either. And now the, the next game that I probably have forgotten about it. Damn it, I was a, f a fourth game. Don't do a poll yet. Forgot the fourth. Because my PC crashed and now the, my file is gone. Uh, I had another one. Oh, Malaka! I forgot about another one. Then we're gonna, we're gonna, when we're gonna, uh, when we, <laughs> everybody's day is gone, it's gone. Um, I had another one. I completely forgot about it though. I have a blackout. Oh man, that blows. Day's gone, Spider Man. Um, Kingdom Come Deliverance and. I can't come up with a third, uh, the fourth one now, for some reason. I've already played all the all the Resident Evil games, Jaeger, and that's not it. It was a first playthrough. No, no, it's not. It's not that either. No, it's not Atomic Heart. It's an older game. Which four? Maybe. Well, that that I can't play. <sighs> Damn, it's gonna bug me now. No, it's not Dishonored. It's something that we haven't talked about, David. <laughs> no, I've played Elden Ring twice already. I've played Cyber- it's, it's not Cyberpunk, I've played Cyberpunk already. It's something that I've never played before. We should speak with oh, Mr. Sai. friends. I believe I can sneak away without drawing my mother's eye. Meet me near Hogsmeade and we will devise a plan. You're such a typical teenager, Natsai. <laughs> I'm just obeying my parents. <laughs> oh, my mom. Um. Oh man, this bothers me now. Why did the PC have to crash? Touch your helm. Thank you for making me the first object of your suspicions. I know who my friends are now, don't I? Yeah, but uh, no, Pega, this is not because, first off, it's not even out yet, so I cannot play it before Resident Evil, so that is not the option. On the Steam wishlist? Might be, I don't know right now. No, I, I think I already own it. So it's a game that I already have. What is this? Oh, okay. Ah! Man, that makes me angry now. Also, where was the entrance to this? It's not The Last of Us, I played The Last of Us, I also played Diablo 2. <laughs> it's not Silent Hill, no, I played Red Dead Redemption 2 two times already, it's not that either. I don't have Yakuza, and I don't know if it's a game that I would play. Where was the entrance to this place again, guys? Was it rather here? I think it was more like here, right? Oh man. <laughs> Where, where's the entrance to the this side of the map, guys? Is it, was it down here? I played Fallout 4 once. No, it's not Hitman. <laughs> Everybody's just guessing. 
It's a big tunnel, like a mine somewhere down there. But it's not here or here or anything. It's, it's I think it was here, right? Rebellion. No, it's not nothing like Enno. It's not a strategy game. It's a story game. <sighs> Fork me life, mate. One of the best meals I've ever eaten. Good for you. Ah, it must be here around, right? Because there's the infamous foe that I defeated. Revelio. Right? How do I get to you? Oh, rats. <gasps> Jedi Fallen Order! Exactly! Yes, that's the one! <laughs> Yes, it's Jedi Fallen Order. So it was Spider-Man, Jedi Fallen Order, um, Kingdom Come Deliverance. No, no, I forget another one. <laughs> but yeah, the third one, the third one was uh, Jedi Fallen Order. Thank you very much. Because it, um, Jedi Survivor something something comes out, right? Star Wars Jedi. Days Gone, yes. So, Days Gone, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, Jedi Fallen Order. <laughs> I'm always forgetting the fourth one. What the hell is wrong with me? I try to focus on the game as well. It's like, I'm, I can't. But yeah, mods, you know now, right? Please, can you make a poll for me, please? <laughs> so my, my brain can get peace. Peace of mind. Is this the entrance? I think this was the entrance. Go on, entrance. Let's go in there now. Okay, I'm sneaking now. Let's see if I will be able to um, one-shot the guy again. Sneaky kill. a bad choice, especially considering the new game comes out in the pro Exactly, that's why I put it on there. Yeah, I read, I read it's trouble. I read it. Just something that I don't really want to read out loud. Guardians of the Galaxy, you know the thing is, I'm not a massive fan of Marvel's humor, and Guardians of the Galaxy is the peak of Marvel humor. I have a brother who works at Gringotts. <laughs> Couldn't pay me enough. Revenue. Revenue. Do we. Ah, yeah. Oh no, was it a very short poll? I would have like done a 10 minute one. I didn't even realize that was there. Maybe we can maybe we can restart it and make it no, new because I think that was very very short, wasn't it? Who's oh there? damn it! Our nine. Can we restart it and make it ten minutes long? Three minutes, but I can do. I think the issue is that there was constantly a message pinned and it didn't pop up really, you know? It just replaced another pinned message. You almost had a nice 
So can we can we restart the poll, please? Then I can also say that it's actually active. I, I didn't see it popping up. I literally it was it was just replaced. It was just replacing the other thing, and I didn't even notice it. Otherwise, I would have made a verbal request to to uh, for people to participate in the poll. How similar is this to a Souls game? Not at all. No, I don't hate it. I can't. I haven't played it. I cannot judge a game by not n without having played it. So that is false. But I think for for asking what people would like to see next, and then it's three minutes, and I even haven't noticed that there is a poll. Um. It was it was almost gone when I noticed it. I I bet many people miss it as well. That's why I'm asking for for reroll. <laughs> how, how similar is it? You can roll. Yeah, you can do this. <laughs> this is pretty much it. <laughs> this is as similar as it gets to to uh, to Souls games. Aha! Now we're in the southern part of the map. 10 minutes poll life, thank you very much. So guys, everybody, what game would you like to me to play after Hogwarts Legacy? And we will beat it relatively soon. I guess maybe tomorrow at the latest. Um, so if you guys would like to participate, I would really appreciate it. So I get an idea. Um, there's four games that you can pick from. You click on the little downside arrow. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. And then you uh, click on the game that we would like to see next. And then don't for forget to click on the vote button as well. Otherwise, it's not counting. It's anonymous. You can be a complete lurker. Maintain a lurker. But the more opinions I get, the better of an idea I get. And I'm honestly curious to see what, what, what you guys are like in terms of games. I will probably play all four of them eventually. It's just a matter of what next. And if you voted again uh, now, if you voted already once, I'm sorry. It's, it's my fault. I missed it. <laughs> Do you know Fable 3? Yes, I played it multiple times. But I don't have my Xbox 360 anymore. Hi, Lord, and welcome. Hi, Casey. Hello. Thank you, mods. <laughs> Chad, use the poll and decide for future men of mankind. Uh, Indigo, I'm gonna play Cyberpunk again when the DLC comes out, yes. Okay, Indigo. Have a good day. Hello, you chunky malakas. Kingdom Come would be a punishment if you played it myself. You didn't like it? I heard good things about it. Like, very, very good things about Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, it's the first time that I hear somebody really complain about it. Is that you, Roland? The course looks rather deserted. I hope everything's all right. I'm over here. Nobody wants to play with her, that's why. Hello again, Imelda. This course is a bit far from the castle, isn't it? Obviously. Evidently too far for most of our classmates. Pathetic. They should be begging me to keep these trials alive, not running scared. I'm surprised our new fifth year showed up. I suppose I appreciate the effort. That's actually... thank you. I know I can be impatient, but I get frustrated by those who don't take things as seriously as I do. And in my experience, that's everyone. Anyway, don't let it go to your head. Right then, enough chatter. I'm confident I've posted a time you won't be able to beat. We'll soon see how I fare, Let's won't see. we? I'm ready. Get ready to lose. 
Combat in Kingdom Come is the worst I've played. Oof. Flash Jab, have a good day. Thanks for hanging out. Okay, guys. That wasn't too difficult. Brilliant. Whoa, camera, why are you doing this to me? <laughs> Nasty, tempting me with balloons here. <laughs> Brilliant. Nothing like Brilliant. admiring Fine. your own flying. Say so myself. So nice. <laughs> I love when he does that. It's so so silly. We did it. Um, it's difficult to, difficult to learn, but a good game. Yeah, I heard that. I heard that uh, people say that. What is your favorite Fable game? One, two, or three? Two, I would say. Two is the game that got me into the Fable that was series. Quite something. Impressive work today, but don't get too comfortable. I'll be on your heels in no time. My family's not going to believe the news when I tell them. They're almost as competitive as I am. Almost. <laughs> almost. It's been fun competing hey against God, your thank record, you. Zamelda. Thank it you very much. It has been fun. Glad you're here. Fifth year. You're an asset to our house. Isn't she also a fifth year? Like you take care of yourself. Hi, Sammy. Welcome in. Thank you for I the GG. Mr. Weeks know that this was his best upgrade yet. Thank you, Pega, for the 300 biddies. I appreciate you. So, guys, there is like, I don't know, two or three minutes left of the poll. Please make sure to give me your vote for the game that you would like to see next after this one. I haven't done one of these polls in a while. But I'm always grateful for opinions. And then on the 24th, um, I'm definitely going to play Resident Evil 4. Hi, Bonotto, why are you screaming? What's with the caps? No, you cannot play this game online. Thanks for the follows, everybody. When our war is over. Percent run, let's do it again. Nah. <gasps> A troll. Oh, that was the wrong button. Defender. 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 Defender.
surrender. I clicked the wrong button. That's so nice. Bombarda. Nice. Jedi Fallen Order, really? But what are, what are the other ones? Wait. Can I see all of it? Okay, Jedi Fallen Order, and then Days Gone is a close second. Okay, cool. Good to know. Good to know. Thank you very much, everybody who participated in the poll. It means a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I don't have a Vada Kedavra. And... Hell yeah, Jedi for the win. You guys would be interested in me playing Jedi. I have- I- I've watched the old movies, the, the first six movies I've watched of, um... Um, of Star Wars. But after that, I- I haven't watched much. I think I watched one of the newer movies as well, but that's it. Trolls no match for this. Actually, you think trolls are pr pretty easy to fight. I issue I have issues with mobs, so multiple enemies swarming around you, especially in this game when they can be far away from you and they can teleport towards you so quickly. Lead to Hogsmeade. Like the uh, in Fury, they move so slowly, but then suddenly they get the zoomies and then they sprint at you or like teleport As towards you. As my favorite test flyer, what are we looking for today? Her Days Gone is on PC as well, done port. I have all of these games that were up for vote. I already own all of those. I just never played them before. I wanted to report Thanks for to stopping by. Hope to see you again. I, I hereby return to you. <laughs> Hello again, Mr. Weeks. I set a new record at the South Course. Fantastic! Your broom performed well then. The best upgrade yet. It flew beautifully, incredibly nimble. But with the speeds it now reaches, I can feel the wind catching beneath the seat a bit, preventing it from reaching its full potential. Of course! Should have anticipated that. Exactly the kind of report I've come to expect from you. At last, I think I know what needs to be done for my final upgrade. Okay. So, by the way, guys, I will see about it. Um, also, if it's a good time filler, I don't know how long Jedi Fallen Order is. But um, I think I would either then, like, because it was second vote, either Jedi or Days Gone as a next playthrough. I shall look forward Thanks to for speaking participating. again. I'll be sure to send you an hour when I'm finished. Thank you again for your help. Couldn't have done this without you. Sky is the limit. Dum. A three or four day game for sure. Days Gone is very long. It's not that long, apparently. Uh, if, if I do main story, it's 40 hours, it said, on how long to beat, and 50 hours if I do side quests as well. So it doesn't sound as if it's super long. Sounds manageable. And sounds like I could be able to beat it in the time that I have until Resident Evil 4 comes out. Wah wah wee wah. 
You know what? Maybe I should go to to my room of requirement. Hogwarts map. You make a good team. Which one, in your opinion, is time-wise better, Jedi, or, or Days Gone? You should, should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Since I don't know how long Jedi is... I can't really judge that. Desk of... Identification, there you go. If you focus on the main story, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order is about 17 hours in length. If you're a gamer that strives to see all aspects of the game, you're likely to spend around 31 hours to obtain 1% completion. Okay, so 31 hours. Um, so it's a relatively short game, huh? Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Thank you, Tangent, for, for looking that up. So, and now I wanted to go back to Hogsmeade and sell my stuff. There's lots of back and forth in this game, right? You can do so much stuff in Days Gone. Yeah, I think so. I had 76 hours in Days Gone, 100 percent all story nights. That's, that's the thing, right? If you do 100%. I don't know if I will do 100%. Is it more cozy than Hogsmeade? Is it a difficult game, Days Gone? Uh, orientation. Eh, eh. Hi, Pippin. I want to sell my stuff to you Come once on more. Healing potions are a speciality. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Tell me all about it. It would be cool if there would be the information about what is better. Huh, actually, not bad. But there's one that. Actually, it could go full. Full pirate, eh? Arr. <laughs> Arr. Should you need any? Hi Nimue, welcome. Hi Copcat. What can I do for Hi, you? Hi Serino, welcome in. Hi Nailed It, good to see you. How was it going, my friends? Oh shit, almost said that. Oopsie poopins. Sold. It's sold, not sold. <laughs> okay, I have a better scarf. Keep that in mind. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Better scarf, better scarf. Doop, 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 doop. Better scarf. Whoosh. Hi, Zerok. How's the performance of the game now? What um, can I do for you today? There's still frame drops for me on in certain areas, like Hogsmeade and uh, certain areas in Hogwarts. I hope to see you again. Otherwise, Farewell it runs smooth. Now. 60 frames per second, but... Hogsmeade and Hogwarts are where it always drops for me. Uh, Days Gone was not too difficult. Jedi is again one of the I'm so difficult games in my opinion. Uh huh. Okay, so one of those um, we need to make difficult games kind of games. Need a new. A uh, what? Not difficult, but you will need a new after it. A what? A platinum day's gone. It's not difficult except if you let yourself get swarmed by zombies. Hmm. I haven't seen much of it. Like, I just popped into some streams and checked it out, but that's it. Hey, Mac Garnicle. Never watched your stream before, but just wanted to say hilarious you named your character Malaka. <laughs> Welcome into the stream. So, what can we do now? The headmistress speaks. Speak to the portrait of Professor Neve Fitzgerald. Guys, there's not much left for the main story, is there? I 
I should talk to Poppy and find out why she left so abruptly after we returned to the Dragon Egg. So, if I would just go for the main quest now, there's not much left, is there? No. Have you played Horizons Zero Dawn? Yes, I've played it. I've played it on ultra hard on my first playthrough. It was very grindy. So it's, it's a nice game, but very, very, very grindy. Hi, Eric Shelter. Thanks for the eight month visa. Welcome back. And thanks everybody for the follows. Welcome to the lizards. Never costume. You will need a new one after. Nerven costume. Ah. Ah, okay. Yeah, I don't know why the bot is not working, guys. I have no idea. <laughs> it's just probably because it was uh, it was closed abruptly, right? With the it, it breaks when the PC breaks. Ooh, Hogwarts, and then the map chamber. Yes, I've also played Forbidden West, but I didn't stream it. Not much of it. Thank you very much, Ari Shelter, for the reset for eight months. Thanks for the support. Welcome back. Hello. Hello, Professor. I have news. The goblins are looking for something. Another repository. They've built drills to help with their search. Oh, most troubling. Are these repositories like the broken container I found at Rookwood Castle? They are. I fear we have no time to lose. Have a look at the map. Fortunately, the next trial is fairly nearby. It's Hogwarts. As you know, I was headmistress in my time. My portrait hangs in the headmaster's office. In fact, I witnessed Professor Black learn of your arrival. And I'll confess that I wondered about you. Wait, is the next trial in the headmaster's office? It is. I had hoped that when the time came, the occupant of that office would be of mm. help to us. <laughs> Unfortunately, this headmaster seems wildly unconcerned with anything but himself. You'll need to access the office while he's away. I understand. Very well. I'll find some way to get in. Good. I shall meet you in my portrait there. Until then. The headmistress speaks. Um, How will I get access to Accomplished. The final broom upgrade is better than even I expected. Stop by spin witches when you can. Okay, so... Speak to Professor Fig in his office. That's kind of interesting. I love the relaxing music in Forbidden West. It was really, it was really nice. That's true. You gotta play Call of the Mountain, the third Horizon installment. Isn't Call of the Mountain just the DLC for Forbidden West? Oh, Hi, Kevin. Hi. Welcome in. If you're sure. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. I love the music. It's the VR game, right? Oh, is Call of the Mountain VR? Yeah, then no. Then I'm not going to play it. Definitely not. <laughs> Even even in even in the office of a professor, my character's just taking a nap. Sheesh. Oh, I have to stay in here. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm beginning. Professor Fig, the keepers have shown me where the next trial is. Has something changed? Lodgok and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, like the one we saw at Rookwood Castle. And I discovered that they're building massive drills to help in their search. Professor Fitzgerald seemed very concerned. I see. Ranrock clearly knows even more than we suspected. And sir, there's something else. Lodgok knew Miriam. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. 
She was doing research. That's where she found the container with the port key. He liked her so much that he let her leave with it, despite orders from Ranrock. I don't know what to say. She could win over almost anyone. Hmm. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. Where is the next trial? Believe it or not, it's in the headmaster's office. Incredible. All right. You'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. I've actually met Scrope, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. He's rather devoted to the Black family. He is. So you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing. A polyjuice potion. You'll look and sound like Professor Black. Wait, doesn't polyjuice potion require a bit of the person you want to change into? And take ages to brew? It does. So how do you already have polyjuice potion to change into Professor Black? One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my fruitless trip to the Ministry on his behalf. <laughs> now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain more. He's such a mischievous malacca, isn't he? <laughs> oh. How do you feel? Uh, incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose we'll meet again in the map chamber. It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Now to find the Headmaster's house elf. Let's go. I love this part. <laughs> I love this so much. <laughs> this is fun. I should probably move like this, right? But time is of the, of the essence. Do you have a moment, Professor? Yes, sure. Professor, I was hoping to catch you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp. Places to be. Of course, sir. Only, <clears throat> you'd asked me about a particular potion, and I... Well, I... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best not to discuss it here, sir. I assure you, Sharp, you may speak freely. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you wanted. I can drop it by your office when it's convenient. <laughs> <laughs> of course, yes. No need for all the cloak and dagger. Simply have a student deliver it. A student. Very well, sir, if you insist. I do. And thank you, Sharp. I just hope you've brewed enough for all my boils. Now, to determine which student gets this rather unenviable task. You know what would have if been you amazing? Must speak with me, consult my secretaries or what have you. Now move along. I would have loved that there was a group of kids standing here like this guy. And then the moments that um, Professor Sharp says the potion for boils, all the Students Greetings. go quiet and I just mean, turn around way, children. and look, you know, or like giggle or something like that. Master approaching. That would have been super funny, I think. What is Geralt doing in Hogwarts? Uh, learning. Hi, Flash. Welcome in. Yeah, this mission is great. One of my favorites for sure. Has anyone seen my ivory handled hand mirror? Of course you haven't. Headmaster. Yeah, what could he want? You call that a shine on those boots? Do better! <laughs> Do better! Uh, Professor. Don't be word? sorry, be better. No! Okay. Professor Black, again, it is not too late to reconsider your decision regarding Quidditch. We... we could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. It would be better than none at all. 
But the injury, Madam Kagawa. Professor, more than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. I dare say it knocked some sense into them. And they're fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's no reason to... What? Nonsense. That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? I... You are quite impossible sometimes. Sir, I have a good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and Sports at the Ministry about you. Please do. That would be unwise. Please do. Good idea. I can even provide the parchment should you need it. Now, where is my elf? I... parchment? Very well, I will, and with pleasure. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. <laughs> what did we do to deserve him as a headmaster? I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None at all. Move aside. Out of the way. Places to be. Places to be. And he's coming this way. Oh no, what shall you do? What is he what is he usually doing as a headmaster? He's just sitting in his office day in, day out. Hi Galicious, hey Tummy, welcome. Uh, <clears throat> I wonder almost daily why I accepted this appointment from the ministry. Professor, I need to speak to you. Okay. Hello, Professor Black. Ah, Professor Weasley. How how delightful to see you. Sir? Ah, uh, you're sick? <laughs> I have you here. I wonder if I might, um, speak with you about Professor Fig. Oh, very well. I've decided to give him a bit more, uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I do worry for his students. He's rarely here as it is. And I don't miss him. I realize that. And I'd like to keep it that way. I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth year seems to be spending away from the castle, supposedly on Professor Fig's behalf. I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades. Everything from sneaking into the Forbidden Forest to confronting Ranrock's loyalists and Rookwood's lot. <coughs> what? <coughs> Goodness. You cannot believe everything you hear, Professor. No, 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 you cannot. Uh, I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing the wonderful job that you're doing. <laughs> simply wonderful. I... well, I... Um, thank you. But I'm happy to look... No, no, uh, good. no, look. Good. That'll be all, Weasley. I, I mean, Professor Weasley. Good day. Can I ask why you named yourself that way? It's my first time here. Hi, Gio. Leeway for Professor Fig? Um, that ought to give Professor Fig some breathing room. I'm playing a nasty character, and I felt that Malaka is a good name for it. I'm aware of the meaning. Any house elf. Scroop. Oh, Scroop. Greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. Oh, but Master made Scroop swear never to tell anyone, even Master himself. How dare you question Punish. me? I've a mind to give you a Thank matching you. set of ears. Uh, uh, yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. Uh, Scrope begs forgiveness. It is the Black Family motto, Master. In French. Mm. Right. Of course. I, uh... Master does remember it. It's pure bloods forever, isn't it? Uh, uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. It is always pure. <laughs> Obviously. In and French. Of course, as Master knows, in French. Ah, yes, of course. Uh, I order you to pronounce it for me. Oh, Master knows that Scrope's French is most pitiful. <laughs> oh, very well. Uh, toujours pure. Uh, there is another matter, Scrope. I confiscated this filthy diary from a student. It smells of squid and seawater. Oh, Apollonia's diary. <clears throat> that is quite a surprise, Master. 
What do you wish Scrope to do with this treasure? Uh, uh, rubbish. <laughs> Whatever you wish, Scroop. It's your treasure. Now, off with you. <clears throat> Punish, thank you so much for the first time sub on my channel. Enjoy the emotes. And if you're watching, thank you guys. Can you welcome a first time subscriber, please, with lots of chunky chunks in chat? Um, hi, small ducky. Thank you. Welcome in. His ears are strange. Mm, maybe because he's an, owl, an elf and also one ear is missing. Chonky chonk chonks. <laughs> okay, so now. The polyjuice potion. I didn't very do this. Long. Ahem. Attention, students. I hereby decree that the Great Hall be forthwith decorated in the stunning banners of Slytherin. <laughs> Nice. Me likey. Me likey a lot. And now get the hell out of here. Oh, burp. Burpity burps. Burpity burps burps. Ah, made it just in time. It's wearing off. <coughs> Fig was right. I can't believe it worked. Now to speak the password to the gargoyle. Nice. Quest complete. The Polyjuice plot. Okay. Um. Um. Do, am I not getting a? Am I not getting a quest? What to do? Just imagine the Hat Master supervisors running like that. Yeah, panic. Access the headmaster's uh -huh. office. There you go. Run, 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 run. Oi. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Like a record, <laughs> baby, right round, round, round. Pick, pick, pick. Hi, Yolani, welcome. Hi, Punish, thank you so much. I love how everybody in this game sprints like a panic cocaine addict, best running mechanics ever. I think it looks funny because- oh, wait, I haven't opened this? Okay, wait, I gotta do this, I love these. Um... 2 plus 15 is 17. So 6 is the answer. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 is the lizard, right? 6? Okay. Okay, and then 19. The hydra is 3. 3 and 9 is 12, leaves us with 7, which is this weird blob there. Okay. This. Whish. Is Wolong long your kind of game? Nah. Not really. I somehow did the banner thing even before starting this quest? What? How? How did you do that? <laughs> David. Revelio. The troll armor. Man, you can get a lot of field guide pages in here. Revelio, 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 Revelio. Of course, Herbology Award. Wah, 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 wah. Revelio. I'm um, a four centaur.
Yeah, how do you solve these? You need to find a, pa a page. It's in um in an attic kind of area. I don't know where exactly it is, but uh, there's lots of those beams, wooden beams and stuff. And then there's a a chalk board where it's uh, and a paper like a field guide page that explains the whole thing. Basically, they're numbered from zero to nine around the gate. Like it starts with zero, and then each each icon has one number assigned to it, and they're in the correct order. So one, two, five, uh, zero, one, two, three, four, five, and so on, uh, until nine. And you just um, hello, Hamora. You just do the math. So the one in the center is the result that you want to have, and you just um, you sometimes have an icon there, which means a number, right? And then you you have to do the maths, you know. <laughs> Roller brawler. I hope that explains it. Anything else in here? Ooh, big chest. Whoosh. The gargoyle. That's where I need to speak the password. Toujours pure. Lemon sorbet. I wonder if all the elite wizarding families have a motto. Hmm. Good question. Can't open this. Hello, Hamora. Hi, Pink. Hello. Do you think wizards smoke in back of the castle like that's where they all go to stress about the finals and being killed because of plot armor? What? No, 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 no. Oh, the sorting hat. It's good to see you. All thanks to Professor Fig's quick thinking. Now what? Approach the pedestal in the antechamber and read the book that appears. I suspect there will be more to this than reading a book. Your suspicions are correct. We shall speak when you are finished. Okay. Has this been under the headmaster's nose all this time? That's the pensive. That must be the pedestal. Okay. I don't know if I can do the thing that I was thinking of, but I think I can't. Aha! Maybe it was this? Yeah, I can't do this because level... Level 3, but look at this view. Nice. Wow, so cool. But we've done all of this already in my first playthrough. It's not too bad. Hi, skeleton. Hello, welcome in. Hi, Jesse. Tranquility, hello. Skyrim mask views. Do you have the same view out of your window? Almost. Professor Fitzgerald, can you hear me? I am here. In this place, you may call me Neve. You shall be witness to a fable. Pay attention. Things are not always as they seem. This was so you cool. You must move swiftly and cautiously. Use the tools you encounter to find me. In this place, as in life, death takes many forms. Avoid each of them at all costs. Make your way through the town without being seen. Okay.
Seems to me prioritizing the key spells would be the way to go to start. Favorite trial simply for the concept of it. Yeah, it's very cool. Oh my god, I, I thought these were nasty. I'd be free by now. Leave must be here somewhere. I need to time this just right. Nobody sees me. I see a staircase straight ahead. Easy. Hi, Panica. A little bit like the one of the quests in Hearts of Stone Witcher 3. Yeah, just that this is based on um How could this happen? Based on the story, like from the movie, you know, the the Harry Potter movie. A ladder. Perhaps they won't be able to find me if I go up there. Climb, 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 climb! Movie, you silly goose. <laughs> Don't watch, climb up! Death, dark death mongrel or something. Death's dark mongrel or something like that. They're gone. For now. I need to get out of here. Where could Neve be? Too many. I must cross this road as fast as I can. That's where I need to go, but I need to find a way past them. Hmm. Hi, Babo. Welcome. Turn around every now and then. Thank you. Okay, he seems busy there, so I'm gonna just go for it. Whee! Oh, there's death. Hello, death. Nothing this way, but more danger. There must be another way to find you. I need to turn back. There's no way to pass on that way. Oh dear. Oh boy. Close tight. No way but forward, I suppose. I like stealthy missions like this. Cool. Hi, Spiky. Your favorite mission. <laughs> you think he's gonna see me? Now's my chance. Oh, he's he's actually backseating me. Okay. Okay. Hi, PF. Welcome. Favorite mission. Uh, <laughs> <forward. laughs> oh. oh, Shh, it's me. I think I'm invisible. They can't see me at all. <laughs> I can get closer to them. I like that they added this part. Thought this that's is very the way cool. forward. Finally free. Now where are you, Neve? Hi Luca, welcome in. How are you? Happy Sunday. I like the singing. You have outrun death thus far. But have yet to find me. Keep searching, but this time you will be unable to hide. Wield the wand you see before you. Do not squander its extraordinary power. 
The Elder Wand. <laughs> I'm invisible. Oh shit, they have ears. <laughs> That's not the way, I guess. Where is it? Ah! Bobada. Ah! Are you telling me I cannot use my favorite spells? I wanted to... Uh, I wanted to use the... the death spells. Well, like, you know, the, the, the forbidden curses would have been nice. talking to yourself do you think so maybe i'm using a different frequency than they do That the moment that I look at my, the moment that I look at my um, uh, my skill set to see what is what, that's always the time that they use a something so I can see the halo around my head. Robotic, thank you very much for the seven month resub. Welcome back, enjoy the emotes. Uh, wait, which way is it? I guess this way, huh? So it's all about the curse life. <laughs> Oh, this part, I remember. Do you remember? Sneak! 
here. There's another troll, really? No, I rolled too early. Oh, shit. Sheesh. right now. Smokes. They just keep on spawning. Oh, my God. Defender. Defender. Dive, come on. Die already. Defender. Okay, finally. Bombarder. The pulse. Descender. Defender. 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 I can't see. What the hell? Anything else? Hi, Duck. Hello. Welcome. Sheesh. It's not 
combat timing, you... I can show you guys. I don't know if you're not aware of this, but... You get a skill set, and you can just use one. This is the only skill set that you have in this fight. You cannot use the curses. Uh, this is all you have, so... It's not bad timing, but... It's, uh... I, I can't. I literally can't. I wanted to, but I can't. Hi, Natal, welcome in. Scarlotta, hi, thank you very much for the vulnerabilities. Love your streams. Thank you so much for being here and spending your time. Hello. How's Wizard Trial 3 going? It's going good. It's going good. How's your Sunday going? Stone. This must be for me. The resurrection stone. Hi, it's Alberto. Welcome. Hi, Nussy. It's actually funny, right? The trial, the first two trials were about uh, you are far from being finished. smart. Pass through the mourners ahead. Nothing is what it seems. The first two trials were like they they want to make sure that the person who is doing these trials is worth uh, the knowledge at the end, right? And the first trial and the second trial are actually about wisdom and like being smart and knowing to overcome obstacles and stuff. This puzzle, uh, like this trial, is about um, killing lots of enemies and being super sneaky. <laughs> I can't believe she's dead. I can't yeah, believe you've done this. Knife. Let us always honor her memory. May her memory be a treasure to us forever. You found me, but you cannot undo what has been done. Wait, thanks the, the magic buddies. of the stone Thank can you. only conjure a shadow of my former self. Thank you so much for the wonder bits and hello to you as well. Hi, Naeem. But Naeem. there is no light without shadow as there is no shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Remember that as you witness my memory. Uh, are you Danish, Norwegian, or Swedish? What's about Finnish? What's about Iceland? I forgot about those. <laughs> um, my roots lay in Sweden. Mostly. But I'm, I am actually from the Danish border of Northern Germany. But, um, I did a DNA test and I'm 82% Scandinavian. The rest is uh, from the area that I was born and living in anyways. Hi Twinkle, you're Danish? <laughs> yeah, I heal all these. <laughs> Swedish Viking the Lost Hawaii shirts, really? <laughs> what a combo. Do you have a beard? I do. Isadora, nice. what you did for your father was remarkable, wasn't it? And Percival needn't worry about the strands of emotion or the traces that this magic leaves. I found a way to contain all of it. You haven't stopped. Goblin Silver. You spoke to a goblin about this. Don't worry, he has no idea what we're containing. We don't know what effect any of this may have. The emotions, the dark traits... You sound like Percival. And as it happens, I do know. It is a source of strength, of focus. Somehow it enhances my ability to wield magic. I don't follow, Isadora. 
I think we can harness it. Power like this is not to be toyed with in the wrong hands. I saw again. what I did for my father. Oh, imagine the good we could do. Everyone is in some kind of pain. What are you doing? Don't touch my emotions. She's an emotion addict. Breathe it in. Oh, can you feel it? Oh, it's Adora. This must stop. All of us. You've kept this power to yourselves for so long because you fear it. I choose to embrace it. I want to present Hogwarts Legacy and you figure it out in the last 10 minutes so you could put up your hood or no. <laughs> Hi Ramazan, only English please, welcome in. Mm hmm, I see Doug. Join the dark side? I already am on the dark side. I haven't received any cookies yet, though. I'm still waiting. Is it true? Has someone completed the first three trials? It is, and I have. But you are so... Young? I know. You must be Professor Bacar. I am. Pleased to meet you. The pensive memory I just witnessed. Was Isadora inhaling painful emotions? She was. <laughs> My face. Nice. <laughs> it was fascinating. I was amazed to see that it seemed to give her some sort of power, and that she could harness it. But how? I worry that you seem more intrigued than repulsed. I hesitate to reveal the location of my pensive to someone who, perhaps, has yet to understand the responsibility of power. I can assure you, Professor, I do. In fact, what you don't yet know is that a dangerous goblin called Ranrock has accessed the repository at Rookwood Castle. He has learned to harness the contents of it as a source of immense power. He plans to use that power against wizardkind. We have no time to waste. I see. Nonetheless, the knowledge you shall gain after you witness my memories is too valuable to share without further consideration. Oof. I shall require time to confer with the other Keepers. It seems we have no choice but to wait, frustrating as it is. I heard what you told Professor Bakar. Isadora was inhaling emotions to gain power? She was. And she pulled emotions, as she did from her father, from Professor Fitzgerald. Without permission. Monstrous! What's more, she said that she found a way to store the traces of magic she extracted in goblin silver. The repositories? Possibly. There's something I didn't get a chance to tell you earlier. Ranrock has been digging at locations tied to the five names he found in the journals of a goblin metal worker named Bragball. Five names? The Keepers, and who else? Isadora Morganak? Precisely. That's how he's been one step ahead of us. Gringotts, the Tower, Rookwood Castle. If the Keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us to more information. Perhaps. I hope to hear from Lodgok soon. I haven't heard anything since I learned of the drills. Oh, and as you've probably guessed by now, your Polyjuice plan worked like a charm. I knew it would. I may have done too good a job distracting Black. I had no idea he can't hold his fire whiskey. <laughs> Scalot, thank you very much for the first time sub on my channel. Thank you so, so much for picking me. Enjoy the emotes and the ad-free watching. Thank you so, so much. Guys, can you welcome a first time Chonky, please? Chonky Chonk Chonks. Hi, Jim. I shouldn't have reacted so bitterly about your goblin friend. I apologize. 
I hope we can finish what we started with the triptych. Please meet me at the southern coast. We can search for the final canvas piece. Yes, let's. Let's do that. Phoenix Rising, Speak Boutique. Shed of the Mountain, there you go. Hey, Mr. Parsley, Sensei, hello. Bradley, welcome. Namiria, Eddie, hello. All the chunky chunks. Oh, I haven't even been here. Oops. Have I unlocked it? Oh, shit. Okay. I haven't unlocked any of these. <laughs> Oh, balloons! I was just thinking maybe we could finish the game today, but maybe not. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know how much is left. It's all a bit of a blur. If you would focus on the main quests now. Did you say retour? <laughs> retour! Very powerful uh, French spell. I love your sweater. Hi, Rocket. Thank you. Got it many, many years ago from my from my friends for Christmas. Hi, Bash. Welcome. Revelio. Is there any fire close by that I could unlock? <laughs> nice. I like the effects of being so fast, like the, the, the camera and the, the lens effects and everything. Isn't there, isn't there a fire somewhere here? I'm confused. Maybe this one? Maybe I can... Maybe I can fly up there. Is that a fast troll up there? Oh, nice. Pardon me passing through. What do you mean? Oh, I hate this. <laughs> Why? That's nasty. Okay, next fire. I would like to have a fire in this area, you know? Let's take this one then. Hi, Ratty Petty. Hello. No flying for you. <laughs> Do you think that's like a, a charm that they put up? Whoosh. Okay. A keyboard and mouse controller. Uh, look over my head. Ah, well, mine a plum job at Gringot. Suit me. What do you think? <laughs> That relic is the key to saving Anne. I know it. Meet me outside of Feldcroft as soon as you can. What? I'm supposed to meet him at Feldcroft, but I'm... What? I'm so confused. Huh? <laughs> I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time, it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. 
These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh, either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Thank you, Bash. Let's thank go. you very much Quickly, for the 1,000 biddies. Spotted. I Keep appreciate you. Thank out. you, thank you. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. We might get a second why. song. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. But it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Thank you very much, Bash Iron, for the 1,000 biddies. <laughs> Hi Saba, hello. Hi C Power, welcome. Two different Sebastian quests. I'm all about the loot, about the loot, no trouble. Okay, so... Can I just hop over here? No. Oh. <laughs> it looked like, from my perspective, it looked like this is connected to this. Uh, uh, I need coffee or something. <laughs> Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Mm. Not everyone does. I know that. All right. Oh man. I'm making small talk. I'm not gonna trek up this mountain in silence. Can you try to be less bitchy about it when you're doing small talk? That'd be lovely. Thank you. Sebastian is so drama. He's like, so much drama. I understand why, but... Ugh. A47. I bet the Thestral Nest is close by. Where? Can any you trespass? There they are. Let's go. Wait! We should have some sort of plan. Should I'm we? through planning. Okay. Got it. <laughs> Oh, hello, huh? Oh, hello, oh, Jesus Christ! Such arrogance! Is that the best you can do? Can bring us! I'm my best! Are you down? There you go. They got what they deserved. Okay. I agree. <laughs> what were you thinking? 
I was Hi, thinking Clue. about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Looks like Branrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going. So, Green Bar, the love of the minimap, your health? Yes. Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. <laughs> Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Well, they think the exact same of your idea, so... <laughs> Make an enemy curse vampire defeat an another. Ooh. You're getting the hang of being an evil wizard, am I? <laughs> I try my best to immerse myself into being evil and wanting death to all. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right. And I'll be most keen to <laughs> Is this unlocked? Okay. Was that your best? Oh. This must be it. Sebastian, <laughs> wait, wait. The zoom ah. From what? Oh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry Mons? and frustrated. Thanks. But charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lord Gok said. Oh, your goblin friend. Stop it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine, fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Yeah, the Agreed. voice sounds robotic. robotic I agree. Hmm, I was hoping somebody dropped a Wigan Well potion, but I guess that's Rebellion. a no. Tower tunnel. I'm always, when I'm so focused on uh, others and then I have to deal with all the spell sets because the cooldowns are just too long, I feel. Um, so far, so And then good. they zoom towards me. I'm always... Charming. Thinking, oh yeah, they're they're out of out of reach. Spiders. They can't hit me. How fitting.
Help us, big spooter. Oh, I didn't see this guy alive. Oh, super friends. Read the world and uh, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Wait, was this the way I needed to go anyway? Nah, nah, this ain't it. Hi, Luck now, welcome. <laughs> Buy a raging coffee. Hi, Crasher, welcome. Bye from work, can't hear. Streaming game, take care. I hope you're having a great day. Thank you. Can somebody write to Crusher that spiders are determined I to wish make him a good day? Us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more. Is it not affected because it doesn't have the green X on it? Where's the Xbox X? Beasts, aren't they? Little. Little? Annoying little beasts? Okay. Okay. A staircase leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Ghost! First time sub on my channel. Enjoy the emotes. Thank you so much. Uh, hi, Vaden. Welcome. I've been watching your playthrough on YouTube and saw you were alive, so wanted to pop in and say how much fun it is. Hey, Varden, thank you very much. I'm glad to hear that you liked it. Welcome into the, to the stream, and thanks for watching on YouTube. Look at this Could place. Really use some not really my style. A bit much if you ask me. I could really use some wig and well potion. Squish. There we go. Oh, fun. Bombarder. Imperial. 
You work for me now. Oh, that was overkill. I thought I... I saw another one with a high... something I think the health bar is broken I don't know for runes and loot always search for loot right chat hi dusky welcome happy sunday to you as well i hope you're doing We've good seeing rune symbols like these before one two okay can't get out of here quick enough let's go hydrate good idea thank you Thank you for the hydrate, Eva. Troll! In the dungeon! Nice! Oh, oh yeah, he was breaking the stuff, I remember. Me or the other spiders? Okay, I think he's back to being angry at me. Let me just have a quick look around. Hi, Rish. Hello. Are you mad again? Damn, I was trying to fix him. Oh, God. Best 
Champion. Nothing like an angry troll to bring friends together. <laughs> Rebellion. Okie dokie, uh... Repair room. Hi, Rish, hello. That was a piece of work. More than one. Hi, Shiru, hello. <laughs> Current events. Trey Nelson, could I help you with something? What do you want to know? What current events uh, are you wondering about? Revelio. I'm currently playing a video game and I am uh, fighting a troll. That's the current events. Such joy I felt helping my father after all these years to hear his voice again. I cannot begin to describe how much I've missed it. I confess I was wholly stunned by the keeper's reaction. I should have expected it. How can they stand by and do nothing when they have the power to do so much good? Who is Professor Rackham to tell me what I can and cannot do with my ability? The audacity of all of them, judging my work without any real understanding of all that I have accomplished. I do have some hope. The headmistress seemed somehow to understand what I was doing. When the time is right, I shall go to her. She may be able and willing to help. Until I know otherwise, I must continue my work alone, for now. But I will find someone to help me. I will find someone else who understands the gift that we've been given and our obligation to use it. I will store what I learn safely away from the moment. For the moment. One day I will be able to share it with another who is like me. A journal entry. Isadora was here. Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> Oh, I was supposed to go this way, right? Oops. <laughs> Let's go. Hi, late. Welcome. Hey, Chaos. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs. But the view, well worth it. <laughs> Hi, provider. Uh, I don't know. I don't really care about such Another things. Barrier. We can blast through it. You would have certain. to ask Google that. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. Good for you. What's the way? Almost as good as if I'd done it myself. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. Okay, we have one, two. Another rune symbol. Confirmed. Three. Fluent in runic language by now. Mods, can you turn on the emote only for three minutes? I'm gonna set up a timer. Chat, emote only has been redeemed. Three minutes now. Please spam some emotes. Everybody come forward out of lurk to spam lots of emotes. I'm gonna I'm gonna join you. Why cannot go through? A lot wait, did I oh I was not fast enough, huh? Okay, I see, I see. Huh? <laughs> do I have to do it in a certain order? Ah, okay. I guess they have a Could different this be time. Area Isadora created? Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. All the emotes, chat. Let's go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. 
We have some Hogwarts themed uh, emotes for everybody who's a follower here on the channel that you could use if you're if you don't know what to spam. Just some ones in chat, for example, or kick or wave. How could I have been so terribly wrong? The headmistress won't help me. I tried to make her understand. She, like the others, is blind to the possibilities of what I can do. I have come to learn that I can rely on no one. But I am more I am a more powerful witch than I have ever been, and I know that it's due to the work I'm doing. I shall not allow my magic to lie dormant as the keepers do. How I despise that ridiculous name, as if keeping power all to themselves is something to be lauded. I confess I have begun to wonder if I will ever find another in my lifetime with whom I can share this work. If I do not, then I shall find solace in the knowledge that I have left them a trail to follow, a path from which they can learn. Perhaps they will do what I cannot, heal the world. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. Revelio. Mm. Ah. I'm stuck. Help, step chat, I'm stuck. The final canvas piece to the triptych. We've done it. Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Thanks for the follows, completing everybody. Perhaps the triptych will shed more light on all of this. Revelio. Emote only is over. Or like, mods, can you please lift it more like? <laughs> Three minutes over. Thank you, mods. Thank you very much. And thanks, everybody, for spamming some emotes. Very lovely indeed. Yes, yes. I appreciate you. Uh... Hi, Shivas. Hello. I do not believe the journey this triptych took us on. Okay, let's place this thing. This is it. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. I want to, I want to. There you go. I love my pirate look. Arr. <laughs> knock, knock. Huh. Another pensive. Ooh. This is what we've been chasing. I wonder. What is it? Memory. Let's find out. Bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. Please have a seat. Hi, Anna. Yes, Isadora. We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. What have you done? I took his pain. I 
Thank you. That worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. Scrapbook silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. Someone will be. Maybe me. Beers and Bob, thank you for the reset for four months. Welcome back. She took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felgroth, the destroyed painting, it was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes, yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. My belly. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain, it's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Hi, Sugar Bear. Welcome. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? Okay. What is a Slytherin? It's one... Um, Slytherin is one of the four houses in Hogwarts. A schoolhouse. Quest log. The Shadow of Hope. Meet Sebastian in outside of Felcroft. Um, okay. How are you doing, little, little Sugar Bear? Good to see you. And Bees and Bob, thank you again. I wish you a nice Sunday as well. Thank you very much for the resub for four months with Prime. Enjoy the emotes. And also, thanks everybody for the follows. Welcome to the Lizards. Go, Liz, go. Go where? <laughs> Um, I'm thinking we could try to go for the end of the game now, but then it would be a very long stream probably because there's four more main quests. I'm thinking about just finishing it tomorrow and like doing some more side quests as well and like taking my time with it more. So maybe we just call it a day now. I found one of Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You're welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. Lord Gok's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. Yes. Is it still not better with the webcam? I, I literally can't do anything about the webcam. The webcam just does its own thing. Um, it sometimes goes blurry when I move too much and then it's like, oh, focus, focus. And then, um, yeah. 
So usually it takes a few seconds and then it's back to normal. It should be normal again, right? Uh, so guys, I would say we continue here tomorrow and finish the game, but without rushing through it, but actually taking our sweet time with it tomorrow. Um, I'm very excited and I can't wait to learn Avada Kedavra and then use it in the end, in the end battle and some side quests maybe. So um, without further ado, I'm calling it.